Yo, 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 whatever my camera at right now. Still haven't got used to that, but oh, right here. All right, so, uh, Batala, you close? Okay, because I'll be doing a little thing where I'll be going back and forth. So basically, we back, we back, 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 back with another podcast. I'm here with my guys, my guys, Vaughn, Mo, for the one time. Um, we haven't decided yet. If, you know, they're going to be on here every week, every week. That's what we planning on doing. So I won't just be myself on here. So we can, you know, podcast is pretty much better going off, you know, multiple people anyway. Don't nobody want to just be here me all the time. But we just going to, you know, go by week by week by week by week. And if, it, you know, we can continue to keep meeting up, then it'd be dope. But if not, then we all understand. But y'all already know we back with another episode of uh, Respectfully Arrogant. Y'all already know what that means. Respectfully Arrogant is pretty much in the title. Yeah. <laughs> For sure. <laughs> For sure. So, um, like I'm here with my guy Vaughn Mo. Pretty much tell us uh, who y'all is, what y'all do. You know, start. my name is Vaughn. I'm from Milwaukee, so we do like pretty much vlogs, pranks, challenge, mud banks, whatever you want to call it. Like I told you, not to be cutting y'all off, respectfully, yeah. Eric. I'm gonna be cutting people off. I'm just, you yeah. know, just talking. Yeah, yeah. But, um, <laughs> <laughs> everybody on here is gonna be part of a part of YouTube, so yeah. like, you know. Pretty much self, and people that's watching this pretty much gonna be already watching all the stuff like that. Right, so yeah. Just basically talk to the people that y'all already talk to. Yeah. Because once they know that y'all do a podcast, they gonna run to the podcast anyway. So. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. This okay. shit ain't big yet, so yeah. they ain't like y'all talking to <laughs> right <laughs> two million motherfuckers. <laughs> <laughs> y'all talking to a niche motherfucker, but uh, yeah, you can continue to go. <laughs> just saying, so go. yeah, that's all we do. You know what I'm saying? We just trying to make something out of nothing. Oh, yeah, Mo. yeah, I'm Mo, man. I be on the tube, <laughs> do a little bit of everything over there, man. I be eating and shit, uh, vlogging, pranking. Uh, I'm finna start this uh, new little um, series I do. I got a character, Grandma Murder. Okay. So mm -hmm. Hopefully this shit don't come out before that. Um, <laughs> and yeah, I... Uh, I just do a little bit of everything. I'm real versatile with everything I do. If you know me, you already know that. Y'all seen Mo. Y'all seen Mo. Mo is like one of the people that goes viral, but mm -hmm. she don't go viral. Like, I always <laughs> see Mo, and it be like, uh, I was going to text Vaughn. We had saw what, um, dang, it was on Facebook, and it had like a million views on there. Yeah, well, and the, I think uh, it was the, the, um, when she was talking, like she was trying to. Mimi fed me a plate with a happy face on it. No, she no, you said. Yeah, but she don't go viral. Like her page just don't go viral. But it's just like maybe some other people be taking your content. Yeah, they take. Yeah, they don't. You were trying to. You were trying to say a word, and you kind of say it. Oh, uh, yeah, I was trying to. I know exactly what you're talking about. I cannot fucking remember right now, but I know what you're talking about. She kept trying to say a word, but Mimi was in the background, but she was trying to pronounce a word, but she couldn't say it. That shit was hilarious. But it was like all your content be took it from like they People take it, take it you, yeah then they well, post my TikTok, it then. my tiktok do nice though i got yeah. like i didn't have this like my third tiktok and i didn't have half a million each time so my tiktok you stay good, losing your tiktok yeah and my instagram <laughs> they be taking my shit but it's cool. oh, wow. <laughs> i don't know though I really she knows she be on there wilding hey, that's I, why hey i do be acting the <laughs> she, damn fool i ain't gonna lie but it's like when i get to a certain amount of numbers they yeah. really take mm -hmm. my shit i don't know why yeah. But you know they out for us anyway. Uh, you know, for I don't sure. know who yeah. watches. So I don't want to. Oh uh, yeah, y'all know how I get you know? conspiracy more. The fuck around to get a shot after this. <laughs> <laughs> fuck around to get shot after this. <laughs> y'all know first episode I, I went. You know when we, we was talking about the little Texas thing. Oh yeah, the little oh, shooting yeah, shit. Yeah, yeah. And I yeah, felt yeah, I told yeah. him how I felt. Mm -hmm. Kind of felt a nigga was getting washed all the way to the crib, you know. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, nigga, better get popped as soon as I walk out this motherfucker. Man, can't say too much. You be nah, like, hold on, nah, wait. Nah, nah. For sure, you is in Texas. Everybody like, carrying. Is that, the, is that when the security got popped? No, the kid. No, the kid. The kid. I know, but it was another one. Oh, yeah, because yeah. the security got shot. Mm -hmm. You yeah. know, and, then, and you know, they trying to say, you know, he made the possible for a car to go off water. Mm -hmm. Oh, right. oh about yeah, that? yeah, yeah, about that? The black yeah, dude. yeah. We were just talking about that. No, that was that was tops. That was at the grocery store top. Oh, that was at the grocery store. Okay, grocery yeah, store. yeah, yeah, okay. That's yeah. what all the black people had. Uh, but I feel like they doing that just to stop to take away our gun rights. They have yeah, a bunch they of people. Yeah, kind of in Texas too. They have a bunch like, of yeah. Well, 
I don't know. A lot of people might comment on what Von just said because, like, I had to delete a lot of comments because everybody just kept saying I wasn't. Yeah, I had to. Why? I had to because you the way YouTube is with like monetization and all that stuff. Like, Mm -hmm. you can't have certain stuff just lingering because you can get yeah. See, I ain't gonna lie, I delete comments too though. The negative comments. I see. No, no, if, if it's negative, yeah. But they was making it seem like I was like, it's kids died and all that. I don't want to go back on my mm. shit. And it's like a restriction. Oh, yeah, okay. Or yeah, whatever. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So too many yeah, people were there. Exactly. Yeah, 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 yeah. Like, remember, Batata, when uh, that Momo shit was going on. Yeah. Bro, oh, that yeah, shit. Yeah, you, bro. You told me about yeah. that and you lost plenty. Of, bro, I'm yeah. like, bro, that video did numbers, bro. They was on some bullshit with that. Like, these, uh, remember they was putting that Momo shit with kids watching mm-hmm. TV and they was that, that scary shit to pop up. I did a video like a funny video of that and that shit it did numbers but then they took all that shit away like yeah. Yeah. so I'm like I'm not trying that to even play with that shit was weird anyway you asked me the bitch was weird so <laughs> why is she even going viral it's some creepy shit she wasn't exactly. even real though yeah she wasn't real was I know co- but it's still creepy <laughs> the fuck but since we did videos to monetize it yeah, they hopped on some bullshit. Mm-hmm. Oh yeah, because it was a lot of it was a lot of extra stuff going on with yeah. that. Yeah, because really somebody like, lost their life. A little yeah. kid lost his yeah. life. Yeah, off that. yeah. Mm-hmm. And then yeah. with the whole Texas thing, so that's why I was like, I'm not gonna just let it linger. Linger. And yeah. some people be looking for like, um, a, what, what's the word we be using? They not gonna say nothing until they see somebody else say it. Exactly. So they're not gonna type Hopping it into, the bad exactly. Way. Bad way, Soon yeah. they see that somebody. Shit pisses me exactly. Off. I was thinking the same. Why you won't yeah. call me fat? When she called me fat. You ain't called me fat last <laughs> week. I just was like, you commented last right. week. That's why I didn't back up from the book bag. Like, what, because- what kills me is she don't gain weight, bro. Like, what and then mean? everybody be like, it look like she getting bigger. I actually wow. been losing weight. God right. damn, give a big bitch a chance. I swear to God. It's crazy, though, because, like... <laughs> they probably see the way that you see now, and they that. seeing, like, oh, she's taking in more. Yeah. It's pretty much like a love thing. Like, you don't know what uh, Teddy Ray, the funny nigga? Mm-mm. Like, Teddy, Teddy Gray? Teddy Ray. Teddy they be Ray. on his same shit about that. Like, mm. uh, if y'all look him on Teddy Ray, he's like a uh, comedian and shit like that. Like, mm. he was losing weight. But then he got super big. And I don't think they coming at you like, oh, you a big bitch. I just think they like, we love this girl and we can lose her. Like, you know what right, I mean? Like, right. that's pretty much what they was doing with Teddy. So I don't know how severe it is with See, you. See, now with my, my people, it's, <laughs> it's yeah. like that, but you yeah. got the trolls who do the same thing. Dang, but yeah. my thing is, okay, it, there's people who love what I do and there's right. people who look at me like I'm killing myself or right, whatever. Right. You don't live my everyday life. Like, Y'all right, see yeah. me eat once every here and there. Mm-hmm. Right. What the fuck? I'm supposed to starve. Right. Because I'm fat. And and when I eat what I eat, let me eat it. But they let forget that you... How long you been big? I've been big my whole life. And they tell you this some shit like you. you haven't... Like, no, I've been big. Oh, but they do something. They'll come on my comments and be like, oh, you ain't a true friend because you ain't helping her lose weight. Yeah, yeah that's good, that's you get what I'm saying. That's, that's it, it and be you like, don't know what I've done, what I've been through. I've lost weight, gained it back. Right. Mm-hmm. We just had a pandemic. I gained, I lost seventy pounds and gained it back right. during the pandemic due to stress and other things. Mm-hmm. Like you don't know my life, you don't know what I go through, you don't know my condition. Mm-hmm. So and that pandemic, when it comes to stuff like that, it just be like, damn, yeah. some nerve for you. But. But then you it's like we, yeah. we influence. You influence. Right. And then yeah. you you funny. I'll I be thinking that, like you said, you been your whole life. There's really nothing you can tell me. You know what I mean? Like, me right. personally, this shit, Vaughn and them have saw me mm-hmm. years. I was skinny as hell. For real? Yeah, this shit probably came the last two or three years. Yeah. No, nigga, that was that pandemic. That pandemic, a lot of pandemic, people got big, though. I was though. skinny as hell when I first started I going to. I all my way back. When I first started uh, going to. Um, I forgot your girl's name. I forgot. Vicky. Uh, Vicky. I'll be having a brain fart when I was here. I was skinny as hell. Then uh-huh. that, yeah, as soon as 2020 came, when we moved down here, it was over. That's when I started gaining this weight. So I'm like, fuck. But I be getting a little sensitive because I'm not, I would, I didn't grow up big type of shit. Yeah. See, but I, just I, like, I've been through the trenches. Exactly. So when people say That's that, it. like, before I, like, before I got my, before I got my teeth fixed, people used to say certain shit. Just be like, bro, I grew up like this. Like, mm-hmm. You can't. You can't. Tell, you can't tell me shit. My mom called me piggly wiggly <laughs> every day. Like, bro, <laughs> that shit do not bother me. But I know they'd get pissed off if you like, bro. I'm not even eating shit, bro. Chill the fuck out, I, y'all. Yeah. y'all. I be eating the and you know what? So she don't even eat they like that. Say she don't even eat like that. I don't. But the camera ain't on twenty four seven. Twenty four seven. But they don't know. They be like, you eat again. Cause they probably mm-hmm. just saw another muck. Boy, is you mad? Cause I got forty k views. <laughs> Cause I'm 
because I'm sitting here eating. Right, like we supposed to just be at home eating nothing. <laughs> but they don't understand that y'all right. post so much. They don't know when mm-hmm. what, what, when it was posted. Wait, yeah. So they think like, damn, these bitches just ate like two hours. <laughs> right. <laughs> like like three hours ago. Oh, uh, exactly. But I slowed down on it. I got a whole nother thing coming. I'm finna do a big switch up, so... It is what it is. I'm working on my health. I'm healthy. Right. Damn it. I'm mm-hmm. just big. Like some people are just big. Yeah. They're skinny people. With right. Like, yeah, for sure. You know what I'm for saying? Sure. So it just be like, man. You know but I mean? her weight shouldn't me. even matter. You feel what I'm saying? Like, like that shit yeah. shouldn't even matter. If I can make this you laugh media, and have though, your, like, yeah, this social media, like, everything matters. Everything, like, everybody's <laughs> opinion. Everything. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. That when they made social media, it gave people. The right to to 100%. say the opinion, you know what I'm saying? Hundred you know percent. If you feel like if that shit gonna bother you, bro, don't even do this shit. Right. That's like, what that's I, what I tell people. Yeah. I do YouTube one on one classes. You know what I'm saying? So right. I teach people the background. Shit. Right. And I that's the first thing I say. I said I say if you're not a hundred percent in love with yourself, if you don't mm-hmm. have a hundred percent self love, this ain't for you. Oh yeah, you right. come in. This, this ain't for you. Yeah. Stop if it. you have any ounce of insecurity. Now, even I got insecurities, but right. I'm in control of my shit. Exactly. You know what I'm saying? Insecurities or you doing it for money. Yeah. Because mm-hmm. it's going to be and a I tell point. I that. It's going to be a point Because this ain't no time. get rich quick scheme, baby. No, that mm-hmm. hell not. You got to put that work in. And shit. she taught me how yeah. to. She taught me to deal with all that. Cause at first I was the negative comments was given to me. Right. But she said, "Shit, that that shit don't matter. Don't let, don't let nobody stop your money. Sometimes though, <laughs> but now it depends. It I'm depends. learning. Yeah. But, but before, he's a lot, right. yeah. Before right. I'd be like, man, I don't want to do this shit no more. Well, where are you but up? now I, it's like, you know what I'm saying. Yeah, yeah, but tell me about some She's other my shit, motivation. Though. You know what I'm like, saying? My wife, my motivation. They right. two motivate me because if it was me by myself, I'd be on that back. Hey, send me your address. You know what I'm saying? Do, y'all do regular YouTube, like, that, like you know what I mean? But Tala, she's kind of like in the next YouTube. She do mm-hmm. ASMR shit. She be trying to do like, shit where it's just like, bro, like your fan base can get her side of YouTube. Her fan base can come and just don't like her. Then her channel is over. Y'all, y'all can argue with people and all this other shit. Like, she can't do that shit. That's why I be trying to tell her, like, bro, don't even. How you figure? You two, like, y'all gotta watch yeah. how ASMR is. It's like. But it, I watch her. Hate. Like, she, I be watching her. But video. you gotta watch other people. Yeah. Too. It's like a hate and a love. Right. They yeah, love yeah, you. Yeah, they yeah. love you. Yeah. If they find they a way to hate, hate you, you, they hate, hate you. you. Like, yeah. if they find out you're doing ASMR for money, mm-hmm. oh, they gonna hate oh, you. They, they gonna feel hate like you're doing It's just a whole bunch of shit to kind of stay on it. But you know what I learned? Because they feel like they own you type shit. You know what I learned? What's that? Your haters get you paid. Facts. So it really don't matter. Listen, I'm gonna tell you something. ASMR is different. Listen, when people. They have to come to hate. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You have to be there to do it. No, but I got a lot of haters, but my views don't be. That's why we posted ASMR videos like that. My, my shit take like two days to hit 10K. And I've really stopped because I'm like, I'm almost at 100K. And that shit, that ASMR shit be tedious. Like, you try to correct your breathing. You even want to do all types of shit. Like, but she know. got that fan base. No matter what, she got that let's, fan let's base, say yeah. she attacked the haters. Everybody that's rock with her, they gonna stand behind I know her. The fuck, they. I mean, you don't think so? Yeah, yeah, I think no. they will. But Tyler, we don't have some incidents. We didn't <laughs> yeah. have some incidents, bro. People look at her and like you got to understand. We're positive, like positive. Hey, but yeah. you gotta, also, she's oh, still, yeah, she's yeah, still light skin. Yeah, yeah, she's still yeah. black. Right. So and the thing is, it's like okay, we fuck with her, all that stuff, but. Don't get misconstrued, young lady. Like we're here because you're here because we're here. Right. So Eggshelly, exactly. Yeah. I wouldn't want to feel like that. But that's yeah. that's just ASMR. That's just how it is. Like think of it's other ASMRs that come out and be like, I feel like this. I feel like that. They won't. They won't welcome them. They will just be like, well, you shouldn't feel like that. You shouldn't like. It's like very right. bashful. It's pretty much like they own you. Like it's it's like that. But they'll pay you. You get paid. So just like an ups and down type ups shit. So down, basically yeah. like. It's like how Will Smith and them have to be. Mm-hmm. Or you have to be just clean cut mm-hmm. or Hollywood not going to fuck with you. That's pretty much what it is because ASMR is a white dominant base That is type so shit. true. That is true. But I also see what y'all got going on with y'all skits. Yeah. Now, do y'all have a shorts channel for that as well? No, I just put all that shit on my channel type shit. On this channel, you should I put start the podcast. You should start it. You, you should know start why? One. Because the shit is funny. Yeah. yeah. And I, I see them all the time. I always see y'all shorts, how y'all how you do your little thing yeah. you do. Mm-hmm. And, I, and that can turn into so much more for both of y'all. And then right. you won't have to feel stuck in that ASMR. Right. Mm-hmm. Uh, but that's why, I, like, my channel that I post this on, that's pretty much what I do. I just post all mm-hmm. the all this, uh, the skits 
And I post this. And then y'all don't have a couple channels? Yeah, we do have a couple channels. We don't post it on there. Mm. Like, do y'all post on y'all couple channels? Uh, not. We haven't been really because we've been busy with her side of the shit. What I be saying like, like right. last I week. Yeah. I swear I got a... A, a, a ASMR family, and a family, family channel. Yeah. I barely post on them because yeah. I'm so focused on my main. And mm-hmm. her, I know how that is. And her is like the main thing. Like we talked about last week, uh, not last week, but the following week on this podcast, we're just like, she's so big, and I'm her manager, so I have to worry about all that shit. Like, right, yeah, she go right. do a video, they want they want that shit revised twice. Now I got to come to her. Like we're we're together, we're in a relationship. Right. So think about somebody coming to you. Like you got to do that video over. Then right. she recording a post today. So just like I've been on top of my shit as far as like you know trying to drop a skit here and or there. But I got her in the mirror. What you about to do? I got to film. Well, this company said they're not going to pay you until you revise that video. Well, oh, I got to shoot man. this. So it's just like, I love the way the way y'all do it. Y'all just be dropping videos, but that was like early in our shit. Yeah, now it's like yeah. very... Story? You said what? I mean, that could come later. That, that really could come later. Like, I was telling Vaughn about like uh, shit like yeah, that. When we yeah, about, yeah, we all talked about it. About it yeah, yeah, we talked about it. That, that's yeah. pretty much a long story. We can probably get into that later when we try to tell y'all. And I'm to glad. Stay away from shit. You know what's so crazy is Mo, <laughs> the one that told me about She said, because I was asking Mo, like, how do we know if it's real? You yeah. know what I'm saying? When it comes to um, like sponsorship and stuff like mm-hmm. that, Mo said, if anything you got to download, don't do it. Don't download nothing. Don't download nothing. I don't nothing. download nothing. I don't even click links. Man. Yeah. I tell a motherfucker just send you me send over me a, a PDF. You need ex- my shit. Ex- ex- right. <laughs> yeah. What more don't, you need? Don't send me you no ask me link. anything else. A link, a, a twist, a turn, no. Nope. Because right. they know what they be doing with them links, bro. Mm-hmm. At the end of the day, when you scroll down, you can actually view it. That's how I view everything. If I know it's a contract or whatever, or I go look or... My my process is tedious though. Like I go in, I might see if you got a LinkedIn page. I might see if your shit hooked up to you know. I might Google you and do mm-hmm. all that extra shit to yeah. make sure. Yeah. yeah, yeah. And like I said, we work with um Ben, another ASM artist, her husband. So he like uh he bring like management, like a lot of ads and all that stuff yeah. coming into and stuff. But right, I was telling y'all like she's almost at a million, so it's just like. Wait till one of y'all get to a million. You know what I mean? Right. And it's just going to be like, the way that y'all drop videos, yeah. it's going to be like, now money is involved. Yeah. Y'all only seeing the money from, like, uh, As from the YouTube, YouTube from the YouTube. Aspect, Wait till yeah. companies get involved and shit right. like that, where it's just like, I got to figure this out. I got to figure that out. And you then they call you like, hey, Vaughn, they want to get you for a 15K. And you like, I still got to go over here and do this other video. I got to do right. this other video. Then right. Mo like, hey, you want to come shoot this video? You're going to be like, right. I still got to eat, go to sleep. I got a yeah. wife. I got kids. Like, mm-hmm. you know what I mean? Like, lucky we ain't got none of that shit, but right. y'all do. Like, you know what I mean? But and, like I said, y'all work 24-7, so just wait till the the, the real money come in, and y'all going to be like, fuck, I ain't right. going to be able to do this, or I ain't going to be able to hang out with you like that, or is everything just going to be monetary goals there? You know what I said, though? I told myself, no matter how big I get, I was always just going to be independent. I right. never really, I'm not saying that I won't take sponsorships, right. but- as far as everything I do is going to be through me right. or my choice of right. how I want it done mm-hmm. or my way. I don't want to be controlled like that. No, no, no. We know like everything. That. No, we're not signing to nobody. It's yeah, us. Yeah, I know. I'm saying uh. like as far as her having to redo videos, I'm not knocking y'all style. Yeah. Do y'all because that's good for y'all. But yeah. as far as me, that control, I feel like that's a bit much. Even when like right now, I um we're partnerships with Fashion Nova. Right. So... Shit, we gotta send them the video to yeah. get it approved. I yeah. don't even like that. But you that's know, where, but that's where the revision comes in. That because most of the times they'd be like, okay, let's say for, let's say for instance, um, we had, I want to put out stuff out there, but this, y'all gonna learn. She had Green Chef. She had a Green Chef. She already already was partnered with what was the other one? Uh, Hello Fresh. Mm-hmm. So let's say they give in, you know, almost seven k for this. They gonna put shit in there to protect them. Mm-hmm. They're gonna be like, hey, we need at least a hundred K. This video is gonna do a hundred K. And we need two revisions. Mm-hmm. Like, what was the other one where they they wanted you to take out a word? They take out a take out oh. they, they said we don't we don't say but sponsor no more. Yeah, I'm see. like, what the fuck? Like So take out that word. But she but ex- No, but she had to re-record it. Mm-hmm. So I told them like, oh, that's gonna be five hundred. They hit me back like you know what? It's fine. <laughs> like no, like we're we're independent. Right. Like we don't we not oh, signed to nobody. Yeah, yeah. But you come to a point where you be like, 
if you want me to do this, you. If got you want this. me to do this, because uh, I be like, I tell him, I send him a whole. Uh, but Tyler, know me, I write up a whole thing. Like, bro, con country creators get paid to do this. Like, mm -hmm. she giving y'all her content. This take time. This take. take she's not know. just jumping in front of a video. Like, right. she going in there, put on makeup. She putting on clothes. She putting lights up. All types of shit. She actually spending Old production. Exactly. Like once she do Hello Fresh and do all this other shit, she taking. She asking me, hey, Jamal, I'm, I need this money for what? I want to get lights and stuff for the video. Right. I'm like, you you actually spent the money even before you got it. <laughs> yeah. Like, it just be a lot, but yeah. I, I asked for a lot. When she was doing it herself, she was the $500,000 king. Like, I'm like, like 500 to like, right. like 700. Right. Shit like that, basically. And she had to do so much shit, bro. I'm like, why are you just not asking them for more? Right. They not going they not going to give it to me. They not going to give it to me. Well, That's how I oh was well. thinking at first too. You, My girl right. was thinking the same same mindset. Right. Listen. If if Costaway want me to do something, exactly. give me 5 bands. Yeah, 5 bands. Exactly. I'm not finna do shit for no $500 cuz guess what? Then I send 23,000 people y'all way and they buying something you making 50 times what exactly. the fuck you just paid me. But I'm, I know y'all got that. I'm, I'm cold yeah, with this yeah. shit. Like, I, I'm, I'm cold. The way that I write this shit up, I'm mm -hmm. like, hey, she do this, she do I'm like, she do like seven mil, seven million a month. Like, if you read my, like, uh, the write up that I sent to everybody, she do like eight million a month. She this on this, you go on this, she top ass smartest of this of the world. Like, I'm mean, the top ass smartest of the world, Craig. Like, <laughs> like I make motherfuckers read that read shit it. and be like, Pay them hey, now. Like, nah, I'll be nah. like, bro, like, if you're not going to talk to her, back it up. man, got the vids. I sent them, the them over. Uh, I'm all about the analytics on mm -hmm. YouTube. Like, I'm always on the analytics. Like, mm -hmm. bro, they she's doing this and she's in a niche of like, what, what, like 17 to like 20, 25 or something. Those are the motherfuckers that's buying. Mm -hmm. So people be wanting that shit, bro. Yep. Now, the only thing that's like really stopping her right now to go to the next level is that TikTok. We didn't have multiple deals that came in that was going to be some some change but they wanted strictly TikTok wow. mm. strictly TikTok and they I, just gave me my TikTok back my old one and I passed so I didn't a, ran the new one up and I passed a few over to uh, Sh Shanice because you know she uh, I keep saying her real name Dang go because she real big on TikTok like mm -hmm. a couple mil so I'll be like sending it to her like y'all gotta go to her she real big on TikTok but they be really wanting that TikTok shit yeah. and I be telling them like you gotta get big that's because TikTok. TikTok is very popular right uh -huh. now yeah, that's, that's like VidCon right now yeah. VidCon it's all TikTokers. Y'all was over going? There. I want to go. Mr. Beast going to be there. <laughs> man, I'm, I'm like, I'm about to spend looking mo. <laughs> she know how I am about Mr. Beast. I've been seeing y'all. I've been seeing y'all been on that. What, what, what's, what's up with all that shit? VCon cracking. I ain't going to lie. VCon popping. You have a lot of influence over there. Okay. Like, they are just, you'll have famous uh, YouTuber, TikToker walk right past you. You'll chop it up with them. They doing videos there. It's just pretty much a, a big everybody convention. Yeah, convention, everybody bro. Yeah. Everybody there just kicking it. Cause we was trying to go that back. same year y'all was When you go. told us. Yeah, yeah. Yep. And then yep. we ended up like, no, nah, we not gonna go. Then y'all actually went. We went. It like, was, was nice. Like, 19, like right? Yeah, we met, um, we didn't meet Giannis, but we got to see him play basketball there. Oh, okay. Sabi actually played with uh, one of the Disney stars that played basketball. Okay. And everything like that. It's just a big convention. Everybody get around. It's pretty networking. Right. Networking. And, and you know what I'm saying? That's like Adenheim, right? It's lit. But, but yeah, it's Anaheim. over this year. Yeah, but it's Usually cracking. Usually it's, you, it's like you, before this TikTok shit, right? yeah. mm -hmm. it was like YouTubers, YouTubers. That's everybody. why we wanted to go. It was all yeah. the black YouTubers. Yeah. Be there. Yes, yeah. but now it's nothing but <laughs> with a yeah. YT. <laughs> For sure. For real. It's and true. it's like, man. But at the same, look at, okay, look at I like. Ain't gonna lie. That's why I ain't that excited about it. Because yeah. I know who's finna be there. But, but no, not, no, but no, 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 no. push you up there, though. That'll but it'll put, that's why I was telling her. But don't get it twisted. Like, okay, the influencer they bring, okay, of course, they Caucasian. Right. But the people there, it's all kind of mixed. It's, right. it's diverse. Right. You got black, Latino, Mexicans, everybody there. So don't don't get it to who they bringing. Right. 
you can meet a whole lot it of people. You know what I'm saying? Who they like front starring? Who yeah, yeah. Front line. I think more I like. like I think I think like more like me. Yeah. I think while we didn't go yet because I feel like they overlooking like kind of a yes. and all this stuff. Why yes. we haven't been creators but yet? My thing is, Y'all see us. how many times right. they do that though? That's like movie star. Everything we do in the world, they always shadow us. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? And like I, we, I'm com- I'm passionate about that shit. Because yeah. last last I don't year, play about that. Last I'm not year, fake it. Last yeah. year, a lot of ASMRs got picked. Mm-hmm. And she didn't get picked. And I'm like, she's one of the biggest ads. Somebody, why she not get picked? Then you look at the list, it's just like. Oh, but oh, you know what man. it is? Another thing, though. Yes. Swat. We all <laughs> beefing with each other. Not really. You, not, not, now, if you look at the um, the whole YouTube world, you have a lot of us minority making videos, talking down on each other, degrading it. All these Caucasian, you don't really see them That's doing true. that. You don't really That's see them doing that. because they mostly in each other's pockets. And exactly. People, so imagine if we do that, if we all getting money together in and investing in each yeah. other, shit, we'll take over. But I'm going to tell you the reason why it don't work for us. It don't work for us because people don't know that it's levels to certain shit. People don't understand Not that when, uh, when mm-hmm. a check True. get broken down, just because Vaughn is right here mm-hmm. and let's say he get less, don't mean next year he's going to get less. Mm-hmm. But you might fuck up the whole deal because right now you're getting less. Right. You know what I mean? And that's the problem with a lot of people. You got you see a lot of people that get bigger and they not going to put each other on. Right. Cuz they like, mm-hmm. "Oh mm-hmm. shit. Mo got this. It's something about her, bro. In a year, she might be at 2 million and and leave me type shit." You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. So they only they want to keep Mo in the dark as possible because it's just something about her. We know she's going to blow. Mm-hmm. But white people is like Hey, my manager gonna search you. They see the star in you. They like, oh yeah, mm-hmm. oh yeah. We gonna get, we gonna get some of that money. Like, oh, she gonna blow in a year. Oh, we well, gonna get some of that. Like, we don't. We try to hide each other. Basically, what I'm trying to say. Yeah, like, but Mo not the type of person to hide yeah. a person though. Yeah, I feel like, like I, I feel like shit. Even if she, if I'm be like, damn, Mo about to blow next year. Right. I'm still gonna support her. This my my sister. Right. Because I know she if she get put on. Mo ain't the type of shit. If I get put on, fuck you. And what did I say she about the type we just had this conversation? We just had this conversation at home. We need more and of I, pe- us like that. People yeah. forget that when somebody's close to blessing, somebody's like, let's say Mo get a blessing. The ble- the blessing is next door to you. Like, so mm-hmm. why are you getting mad? Like, you know what I mean? Like, right, I, right. We didn't got into it with family members, all type of shit, because they want a handout. And it's just like, hey, man, think I about a basketball you. player. I, I think, about, think about Morant or think about Westbrook or LeBron. They are rich. Mm-hmm. Why think about let's say he if he had a sister or something. Why are you getting mad? The blessing is next door. Mm-hmm. Let him take care of himself first, mm-hmm. and he gonna take care of the whole family. Mm-hmm. People fuck themselves up and be right next to each other. Money That's like hungry. me and Bob right next hungry, to yeah. and Bob for the blow up in a year. He's blowing up, and I'm like, nigga ain't did nothing. I asked for it. nigga bought a car, couldn't even give me a, a couple bands. Now I'm out of his life. And then he get way more money. He started looking out for people. Like, bro, you didn't just fucked up. Like, the blessing was next door. You couldn't, mm-hmm. you couldn't wait till it ring on your doorbell. Like, mm-hmm. <laughs> wait till he get his it, house that, taken care that of. That happens every day. Every day, bro. Every day. Every it's, day. It's crazy because it's like, man, you know it's people out there who like that, though. Who, exactly. like, really don't want to put their family on or don't want to help their people. Mm-hmm. Right. And when you genuinely one of those people who do, and then they fuck it up for themselves, exactly. it's like... Why you gotta do that? And man, I feel like give me time. I be feeling like that so many times, especially with these chains and shit like this. Mm-hmm. This shit don't mean shit to me. I've been really right. wanting to do this, but it's just like my brothers and sisters just like, damn, bro, like and I'd have told you so much shit with, yeah. with my family. Yeah. It's just crazy because it's just like y'all can not wait. Like y'all right. did so much weird shit. And, and it was getting better. Like, they it be was too, getting better. They be too, I want it now. Exactly. You get what I'm and saying? And like, and shit, I'm not even there. How I'm supposed to give it to you? You get what I'm saying? But you got to understand, you're going to look like this. You're going to buy the new right. jersey. You're going to do this because mm-hmm. you're getting the money and you right. have to You have to eat first to get full and be like, all right, bring some more people in. I don't need all this food. Right. But exactly. you can't get the food first and start sharing, sharing it, it because you don't know your appetite yet. Right. You might start sharing it and you your stomach start growling everybody like, that shit was good. you like, Fuck, I done shared too fast. Like, right. I ain't even get full yet. I exactly. Didn't, fuck, I still need shit I need. Mm-hmm. Like, you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Wait till a motherfucker get to the money where they, they can take care of their family, take care of their situation to the point where they like, fuck, I want to do something for my mom. I want to do something for my oldest sister. I want to get her a car. I want to do right. that. They don't think, they they see you fresh right now and be like, oh, he mm-hmm. take me shopping, bro. Right. Like, yeah. bro, let me get my, of course I'm going to look like this first because I'm just now touching money, and bro. You know what? I used to question <laughs> that. I used to see YouTubers and be like, 
I know they getting money. Why they ain't did nothing for their people? Right. Mm. Now that I'm living it, it be like I understand, understand. Exactly. because I swear. you gotta do this, you gotta do that. Okay, I gotta upgrade my crib. I went mm-hmm. from an apartment to exactly. a three bedroom to a seven bedroom. Right. Mm-hmm. So now it's like, okay, once my life is where I deserve and want it to be, because right. I'm the one doing the work, exactly. not you. Not you. Exactly. So I deserve to to be comfortable, to be living how I want to live. Right. I don't have to take. Because I'm getting it, take it and give it right to Exactly. You. Mm-hmm. What's the point of me doing it? Right. Like they don't they don't wait till you burp. They don't wait till you yeah, till you get enough food, enough money where you feel your your needs, you yeah. travel, you and everything. Now you mm-hmm. just sitting back like I wanna do for every for everybody. Exactly. Like, Let you me call like, you and say pack your shit yeah, right. Exactly, yeah, bro. I got so a house like, for why you gotta be like my thing hey, is, come get well, me. When it comes to my people, I ain't gonna put no name out there. Right. But when it comes to my people, it kinda breaks my heart. My wife know that. Right. Like when they, they see me on the grind, I'm making, I'm doing what I, I'm putting in the work. Right. It's my money. I work hard for it. Right. You want to come and take it out of my pockets. And then, so if I give it to you, what happened to me? Right. Right. You home sitting back, kicking your feet up, enjoying your life with my it money. Exactly. Shit. They didn't do forget nothing. that we don't have a 401k for this shit. People forget that forget you can go five years making, you know, like this year, this is as much money we ever made in a, in a lifetime but oh, my mama next year could be sad exactly mm-hmm. that's why i'm so big on like savings and shit like this right. could have been there to change this could have been there but if people watched us the cars and the house that shit came we was grinding in milwaukee for like yeah. four five years before yeah. we even came here we came here 2020 in july like, mm-hmm. you know what i mean we could have been made a move we could have been got the money and just moved but you have to just wait until shit is in order because you're going to blow through your money then be right back right type back, shit. Like, so you don't understand. Exactly. You have to save. Mm-hmm. I don't care if you only making two bands. Try to live on 500. Like, mm-hmm. at least try to make some shit happen with that two bands two or three bands. bands. Right. Don't be living 40% above your means or whatever. Mm-hmm. Like, I'm all with percentages, bro. Like, yeah. like and, and that's why I got to learn. A lot of YouTubers do that shit. A lot yeah, of YouTubers. A lot of them. Man, a lot they be, man. Chains, whips, and be so in debt. You don't have, and you don't have to do that shit, you bro. Got a People, flat, bro, got but you do. three, four. You because you, the internet is a motherfucker. No, yeah. it's not. If, if, listen, this, if, listen to my point. People get on the internet to see what things they do not have. Right. Mm-hmm. So if you're flashy and you know this is keeping up your numbers and this mm-hmm. is gonna make you blow, you're gonna do that. But you only, but you only, us as black people only feel like feel like that. Shoot, Superwoman, um, Mr. Beast, um, all these what Logan Pauls and all this shit like 2017. They wasn't rocking. They doing that shit now because they millionaires. Mm-hmm. But to keep them, they was doing the white people shit. Oh, I didn't walk in. And it's three thousand balloons. We want. We the ones that be like, <laughs> I just bought the Lambo. Right. Hey, I'm in debt. Hey, I just bought this big ass crib. It's just me and my girls. I ain't got mm-hmm. no gun. Come rob me. Like shit, like that. Like, but but they gonna make some shit entertaining. Like Mr. Beast, you yeah. do not see like. He don't, he don't wear no necklace, no nothing. Before Mr. Beast got to the level where he's on now, it was like the shit that y'all don't wear, yeah. just like uh, college. He was doing ta- tacky yeah. notes on the cars yeah. and all that extra ass shit. Where it's like he's not rocking no chains. Mm-hmm. Most of the time, like Superwoman, I don't know uh, if y'all know who Superwoman is. She was like the real goofy back then, Von, and she jumped on uh, YouTube and shit and got real quirky and been like doing like skits and shit, like real funny skits, breaking the people's houses and shit like that. You didn't see nothing she bought. If you was on Insta, if you was on Instagram, you saw she was flexed up. She mm-hmm. was the first one with a Tesla, all this other shit. But once you got on YouTube, she went to a, a spot in her house that you couldn't see shit and was like normal as hell. You dirty clothes, all type of shit. But then you go on her Instagram, like this girl is living a fucking life. It's no wonder why they do that shit, bro. Mm-hmm. But us black people, mm-hmm. if we feel like we gotta show this shit, we feel and like we gotta, and that's the reason. But I just feel like it's us. I don't feel like I feel like you generalized it. Like I don't think I just think. It's but look us. at look at it. This like um, you ever heard the Willie Lynch um theory? Yeah. Like we no matter what we gonna be slag. Like that's our mentality. We yeah. think we gotta spend. Yeah. That's why I was just be talking on my YouTube. I'd be like, why would I spend a hundred k on the chain? Well, I could spend a hundred k on some properties. Or some but houses. it's not all about. But that. a lot of people lack like education. Yeah, that's what it is. But sometimes education is just education. Just don't. Knowing not it's education knowing, and not having a lot of OGs. There's not a lot of OGs around them. No but more. then, but then they forget that you know that. Mm-hmm. So they come around and be like, 
I just saw Mo and Vaughn go and spend all this shit on the chain and they ain't do this. And they be like, how you know how I ain't do know? that? Yeah, yeah right. How you know? Yeah, how you know? I bought a chain and you, you got motherfuckers that'll take that shit. It's people on here that make YouTube videos just to bash motherfuckers and be like, we see him buying chains and he's still renting. He's still, how you know? How you know I'm not... In, how do you know what I'm doing? I just bought a chain. No. I just bought a chain. And for some reason, they just told you everything about me. Like, mm -hmm. what if my savings is correct? What if right. I'm taking care of my whole oh, family? Right. My gift to what, all my right. hard work. Exactly. Right. What I if got I just two thousand videos? Shit, right. <laughs> what if I did this shit three years ago and just now paying Man. it off? That's like right. now. A lot of people. A lot of like a lot of people. They be calling me broke, right? Right. They talk shit, talking about mo take care of me. That should be good. That should be compliment. And I though. be like, I be like. Take care of what? Fucking <laughs> like, I pay my own bills. But I feel you know like I feel like you're taking it the wrong way. Yeah. This, even if you're not taking it the wrong way, that's the perfect spot you you want to be in. But I don't do. talk. But yeah. I don't talk stuff about it. I just let it ride. Right. You know what I'm saying? I just be like, okay. You know what I'm saying? If you feel niggas, like she talk, take care of me, then a lot of niggas you know what got mean? this thing where they see a YouTuber come up or something and they will stop fucking with them. Yeah. For some reason they will see you blowing up or they will see you like really winning. And stop fucking with you. Right. I know people personally. Yeah. I know per people personally. I'd be like, bro, like, um, what's the dude name at work? Uh, we used to work at Walmart, and we started getting big on YouTube and shit. And I with no leg, dude in the wheelchair. Oh uh, no, I'm talking about oh. I work with like oh, personally. Okay. I work with. <laughs> no, he used to work at Walmart. What's <laughs> like, why is everybody laughing? Well, he did not leg. You know who I'm talking about? He in Milwaukee. He got no legs. He was on, he was on the what's the name show. They no. put him on a, on TV. He ain't got no legs, no arms. No, bro. <laughs> Man, get <laughs> going. <laughs> The whiskey is whiskey. <laughs> like, I need another drink. No, right, right, right. Me too. Uh, it. It. <laughs> Y'all want to get them a drink? Please. All right, so we back. We had to get some drinks. It was parched. <laughs> <laughs> But no, uh, yeah, I got the name. It was Brian. Um, and Brian watching this, he, it's true. He already told me. But basically, he was following me on like uh, Snapchat and all that stuff. And y'all know I'm a big sneakerhead. Mm -hmm. And I used to post sneakers and stuff like that. And he just stopped watching me, stopped following me. I'm like, bro, why you stop following me? He like, bro, you be on there doing it too much, bro. I ain't trying to see you do all that. So at that moment, I'm like, oh, we only cool at work. You see me moving up in life and it's just like, you just man, hey, no. yeah. You just I'm ne I'm never done no shit like that. I've never looked at nobody like, oh, bro, just bro, always showing shit. Let me unfollow him. Like, bro, I that's kind of like people have that in their that character. feel like hate to me. Yeah. Like, yeah, little, hate like, like yeah. I cannot imagine Vaughn passing me, right? And then I'll be like, man, I can't, I can't even fuck with you. I can't even watch that shit. I can't. I don't even want to be your friend no more, right? Because you start passing, I'm congratulating. Exactly. I'm not gonna sit there and hate because. In my heart, I want I exactly. want you to mm -hmm. do that. Like people, people genuinely will f like quit fucking with you. People for just says people weird. forget that, that you people me. forget that you need. I don't know if y'all take this word like babies in like a disrespectful way. I don't take it in a disrespectful way. Some people need babies, and what I mean, baby is like uh, Mo might start first, and Bob might be our baby, or whatever the case may be. Some people need that, because, like, I always tell people this incident, what happened with Flight and uh, uh, Cash. Yeah. Flight reacts? Yeah. yeah. Flight, 2017, mm -hmm. 2000, going to 2000 and, what was it, 18? 18. Flight wasn't getting no views. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Like, his shot was, go he was going down, mm, yeah. but Flight was the one who gave like Cash really like some clout. Mm -hmm. And at that moment, Cash was like going crazy with the basketball content. Mm -hmm. And at that moment, I seen, cause I watched both of them, I seen with my own two eyes where it's just like, Flight shit is not doing no numbers, not doing no numbers. And he in a million. So you're not touching 100K, bro. Like what's going on? Right. I saw Cash literally take dude and start putting him on his videos and shit like that. And mm -hmm. I told Batala, I'm like, this is what, having friendships in the same so, facility, yeah, dude, yeah. because you don't know when your time gonna be when yeah. niggas say, okay, it's been 40 years, I'm tired of him, or your yo market grow up. Because mm -hmm. a lot of people, we all do it for kids, and kids watch our content, they mm -hmm. might get to 20 years old in college and be like, I've been watching Mo for a couple of years, I'm finna go to somebody else now. Right. And you know, you done been, you done been a nigga who kept all the secrets to yourself. Mm -hmm. Now it's like, now you need help and you ain't even bring nobody up with you. Mm -hmm. It's just like, bro, like now you fucked up. Yeah. That's why I always told people, I don't care if you 
little, bigger than me, whatever. If you ask me for anything, bro, I'm going to tell you the whole knowledge. If I'm coming out with a hot dog, you, where you get that hot? Right over here. Like, you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Because, like, at that moment, you don't know when knowledge you're going to need power. somebody, yeah. bro. I don't know. Like, I, and I remember Vaughn. That's why I always bring a Vaughn when I'm talking to everybody, bro. Because, like, yeah. he's the only person that was, like, really curious in Milwaukee that asked me about it and was just, like, every time I came back, he was, like, consistently doing it. Like, I'm doing this, I'm doing this. Or he'd be in a, I'd be in a chair. He's like, bro, I'm about to quit. And I'm yeah, like, bro, no, nah, bro, don't quit. You got to keep going. You got to keep doing it. He's like, man, this YouTube shit, man, I don't really know. I'm like, bro, you got to keep going. You got to keep going. And it's just like, I feel like Vaughn should have been my brother. Vaughn yeah. should have been my sister because these niggas be on me 24-7, but they looking for a handout, bro. Right. Like, you know what I mean? Like, I did so much shit for my brother and sister. I ain't trying to go down, down a path of me. I, mm-hmm. I'm talking about... I done bought whips. I done bought people got right now, people got apartments in my name. I didn't have to pay rent, what, two or three times a dollar? Because they not paying it. And it's on my name. Mm. Motherfuckers be like, hey, yo, baby sister Sharita didn't pay her. Y'all gonna get evicted. Y'all gonna get evicted. I ain't never was late. I ain't never got no eviction on my name. So I'm gotta go send hey, money. Yeah. And I ain't get no calls from her. No thank you, big bro. None of that shit. Mm-hmm. Like, you know what you're doing. Soon as that lease up, is over. You know what I <laughs> like, always say? Bro, it's that, over. Listen, it, it's kind of like this. We're, we don't choose what family we're born in. Right. We right. don't choose our siblings. Right. It's, it just happens how it happens. Right. When you can take control of your life and the people you surround yourself with, that's when you start a family. Right. Mm-hmm. Because growing up, my family was my family, right. but now that I've taken a different path and everybody's still at home in Milwaukee, mm-hmm. I'm here in Texas by myself, right. but I don't feel alone because I have a family. Right. The people I surround myself with is my family. Okay. I can count on them before I can count on my real So both of y'all, tell me about y'all, y'all way of like, okay, survivor's remorse. Well, how do it affect y'all having like, do y'all do or do y'all get survivor's remorse? You mean like, do we feel bad for where we at? Yeah, for other no. people. No, no, y'all don't. Can't. Why? Y'all don't wake up one morning and just be like, "Fuck!" Like, no, like, you know why? Because hey, they had a because nice ass career, not, bro. Not, no, no, <laughs> they had a listen, nice bro, ass career. Because four years ago, I, I, I man. Y'all don't just go outside. And, make me emotional because. But, but I'm just saying, wait, wait, wait for you. You don't go outside and see that water, va. Come on. Mm. You know, I know, I, I know you. y'all shit, yeah, like four Let years, four, five you. years. You don't go outside and get emotional like, fuck, I wish I could get Lil Bro with me. I wish I could. Mm. Fuck. Listen, like, I did seven I years. Oh, go, yeah, so go ahead, go ahead, yeah. go ahead. No, you know why? Because four or five years ago, when I first started this shit, everybody, I was putting it in their ear. I'm like, I'm finna do this. It's right. gonna fucking work. All I need you to do is believe in me. Right. Mm-hmm. Nobody did. So... I got the biggest fucking heart, like a big heart. Big right? heart. So if you're not gonna believe in me when I started, mm-hmm. now that I'm showing you where I'm at, right? Now you want to jump on the train? Mm-hmm. No, because you didn't believe in me in the beginning, beginning. and Facts. I don't deserve that because I would have right. never done that shit to you. I would have been right behind you when you started from the bottom, when you was passing out cards. But do, but do, but, but do you find, but do you find moments where you still give in sometimes? Yeah. All the time, and, she and like a the girl be like, time. "You doing that shit again?" You like, yeah. oh, "I'm just sending she, this cash she do out." That, and I do it. Yeah. Vicky all be on time. my ass about all it all the time. All the time. I ain't scared to say. I just sent my mama a thousand dollars. Yeah, that's, that's me. That's me. But my mama took yeah. care of me. My brothers and sisters. I got a couple of them that can call me and ask me for anything because guess what? If I call them, they got it. Right. But as far as everybody else who want a handout. Kiss my ass. Right. Mm-hmm. Because when I was telling you that I'm finna grind it out and that this shit gonna take off, I, I, I seen the vision. I'm like, I'm looking at these other YouTubers. I'm like, I can fucking do this. Exactly. Mm-hmm. What the hell? This is what I, thank you, God. You put it in my lap. Right. And then it went from there. Then one day I did a video, blew up ever since I've been gaining. Right. But when I started, there was no, I didn't know for sure. Right. I was just living on a dream. Right. Why couldn't you back me in my dream? So right. now that my dream has come true, right. now you want to hop on the goddamn Aladdin yeah. map. Because uh, some bro. people feel like 
No. You're on YouTube. You're doing this. That mm. money. You're not really working for the money. Like, she, where do you think this money is coming, coming from? from? Like, from like facts. bro, yeah, niggas working. is up late nights working on shit. Like talking to these motherfuckers, bro. Like, mm -hmm. this money is just not coming out of the Creative tree. Creative block right. is a motherfucker. Yes. Yeah. And for some reason, they think we as black people, we think that we just have to go out there and have like manual labor. And right. the money is real. Like you got to go out there and really work. They ain't like, bro, you can do this. You can do that. Mm -hmm. You buying all them shoes. You buying all that. That all falls I back to not being woke, dog. Exactly. Everybody want to work for the white man. Why? Exactly. Why? Why, Why you don't want to own your own LLC? Exactly. Why you don't want to do shit? Why you don't... I, this is a... I'm privileged. Right. Black privilege, baby. <laughs> right. I wake up in the morning and I'm with my kids and my wife. Right. Every day. And I ain't got to go Every nowhere. Every day. And we right there. And make we, it, can make go to, money. we can go to Vegas. Make yeah. it we money. can go to New York. Here. We can go to Atlanta. Right. And, we and, go wherever we want. Right. And so, work and make money in my right. fucking sleep. Right. Why right. not? And let me piggyback and off... Nobody, um, uh, no, we, let me I'm piggyback off the conversation when you saying, like, being guilty. The only reason I ain't guilty is... When I did seven years, none of my people took care of me. So when I was in prison, lowest moment. I had I just told my friend that he he still he doing eighteen years you told right me now. You, went to you didn't tell me you did seven years. Seven Man. years in prison. I told my mom stop coming because all you doing is telling me you coming to visit me, but don't come visit me. Right. Now you give me false hope. So every day when you say you come, you don't show up. I'm mad. I'm getting into it my silly because of so my they, anger. They ship you up. You yeah, up north. Oh, I did seven. Oh, I did three, seven oh. years. So, wow. them seven years, I learned how to be by myself. Right. Them seven years, I learned how to grind by myself. I, I learned how to get money by myself because nobody was taking care of me. Right. So, when I got out, I came out with 12 Gs because I went to work with these. All my family ate my money. And after when I was broke, they shit me out. They didn't do nothing for me till I met Vicky. Right. Vicky was the only one taking care of me when I was out there on the low. Right. You know what I'm saying? So, for me to be like, shit. Man, I'm trying to. I got my own family. Right. I got to take care of my own family. Right. Cause I know when I'm down and low, you ain't gonna pick me up. Exactly. See, when I called you and be like, "Hey, I need five hundred real quick." Right. The only person I probably could call and say is my grandma, my brother, and my mama. Right. The only people that probably cash me out. Right. Anybody else? They be like, "Hell no, I'm hurting." So ain't bro. no, right. ain't no, ain't no. Uh, what you call it? Uh. It ain't remorse. no remorse. No. When I sit back in the lake, no. I look back and I be like, if I was to thank a motherfucker, I, deserve I it. thank Vicky or I thank Mo. Right. I deserve it. Thank you. I deserve to be where I'm because at. Because guess right. what? We right there with each other. We doing this shit. Right. right. Them, them, all them people back at home, they ain't got nothing to do with it. Mm -mm. They didn't watch shit. They didn't share shit. They didn't right. tribute to shit. Nothing. Right. Don't they even watch do my it. shit. Right. Now they watch my shit because they think I'm getting big. Right, right. You get what I'm saying? Now they watching my shit. How do that affect your family as far as, like like you said, with your daughter's situation? How do that, like... It bring hate. They okay. A lot of people hate. that. Like, my family, they be, oh, he think he better than us now. I swear that's right. their Oh, he think his, he doing this and that. They don't know. Like, I'm, I'm still broke. I ain't going to lie. Right. I get a little money. I can pay my bills. But shit, after I pay my bills, I got... You know right. what I'm saying? I'm back back. Like, nobody, nobody's... Rich, rich. Right. Like, you know what I mean? Nobody's rich, rich. Right. Everybody got their own definition. Yeah, exactly. Right. You're right. <laughs> Damn. Making it look you know damn I mean? good. For damn sure. good. For sure. The <laughs> other day, uh, I, my sister, right? I ain't had enough to give it to her. Right. After I told her, no, guess what she told me? Fuck you, you dead to me, you now brother to me. You know how many times why I'm like going? Why would I care about where they at in life? Right. I don't know. Some Something about me, maybe because I grew up Do with my grandma. I had that shit so much. Why? I don't. I don't. <laughs> you got it too. <laughs> no, that she oh, said. That she be me personally. I have it bad because like you were close to them. No, we wasn't really close. I just like I grew up with my grandma and my mm -hmm. mom used to. I don't know why she didn't really fuck with me like that, but she mm -hmm. fucked with everybody else. I got eleven brothers and sisters, mm -hmm. and I'm the third one. So. We all from pretty much from the oldest or the youngest. From the oldest, oldest, okay. So, so we all pretty much kind of close to each other. Like she didn't, she didn't stop having kids to like two thousand what five. From two thousand, my oldest sister was born ninety one, all the way to two thousand five. Wow. So I think her biggest break was after my brother, after my brother, and the one. Of, Right after me, and then I think they like a four year span. Mm -hmm. But other than that, everybody else is like uh, back to back to back. And I just think I'm more, 
I don't know. Like, it's survivors because I seen everything. I seen, yeah. I live with my grandma. I seen how my brothers went through so much shit. And I just be to a point where I did, I did, I did enough. But did and you make the I change there. though? What you mean? Like you made the change in your life to know that you want better in life. Right? Oh, of course. I'm the. I'm, so why, I'm probably the first person to do right. everything in my life. So family. why would I, I worry about people that don't want to change? That's like when I tell my little brother, now I respect my other little, mm -hmm. my youngest, because he's a hard working person. I think, I think the biggest thing is, not to cut you off, and I think that Batala said, I don't think we have kids yet. So when I. Because it's just you. It's right. just me. Right. And okay. I feel like we've done enough. Mm -hmm. So like, sense. let's say like when we save and we save and we save and we do the little shit that we do. Like, babe, we just got buddy. Yeah, let's. And, and it's yeah, not like right. it's not rich, rich. You might right. got a couple. You, you know what I mean. You probably got you know Damn, a love thing to give away. Sucks, but bro. then you get on social media and it's like, yo, older sister that you don't fuck with just then I'm said the same addicted. shit to me. Mm. Be like, I don't know where me and my kids finna go. Mm. I don't know where my little. then they all my other you know siblings or my cousins now. How the fuck are you going through that? Yo, brother. We see him doing this. We see your brother doing this. We see your brother doing that. And it just, I'll be having It some, becomes your problem. It becomes my problem. That's so, so, crazy, so I bro. go and buy some sneakers, but it's just like, I had guilt. Like, God damn, I'm about to spend. Like, we, see, I don't have guilt. We we went in product. Nigga, we went in product and spent but, seven bands. I walked out that motherfucker like, you supposed to be happy. We right. walked out that motherfucker. I'm like, but, yeah. See, I don't I have guilt, know, but like, I'm damn, the type. Motherfuckers Let me are tell fucked you up. Jay. Like, <clears throat> Everything you do, all of your success is because of you. Right. Mm -hmm. You work that hard. Right. You are the person who drove yourself to do it. You and your wife. Right. So as far as everybody else who's grown with kids and chose their path. Right. That's their life. Right. When you die, you're going to die by yourself. yourself. Right. She's going to bury you or you going to bury her. Right. Mm -hmm. Either way. And I that's just be, why I, I just be feeling like I be want so like crazy. sometimes you just be want motherfuckers there like yeah. like you do but you can't make them be I know and that's where I'm you trying to run, and them. that's where I'm trying to learn now like I you know what I mean like at the hard and way. that and I feel like that's one of my reasons not to go down on my you know like we have an yeah. <laughs> but uh, intervention but I felt like that's where I didn't really let a lot of motherfuckers in mm -hmm. like yeah. I used to be that nigga to be. I chop it up with you for me to be on the go. Like, oh yeah, we can do this, this. but I never really let motherfuckers in just mm -hmm. because of shit like that. Like, mm -hmm. I tell Batala all the time, like, I had friends and shit. Like, bro, you never try to kick it. You never try to do this. I'd be like, well, I'm trying to do that if I got brothers and sisters. I always thought like that. Like, mm -hmm. damn, if I get close to Vaughn and let's say me and Vaughn go do something and I surprise Vaughn and I, I bought Vaughn a necklace, I'll be sitting there like, I got. Ten brothers and sisters, I could have did that yeah. shit for. Like, but why did I just what? do that for him? Like, I be doing, I be thinking about shit like that though. But you but, know what's crazy? And I forget that they f said fuck me. Like, you know what I mean? Like, exactly. Yeah. They said fuck you, right? Mom, right there in your corner. Exactly. Why don't this person? And that's how I think about it. My brothers and sisters, they don't fucking help me with nothing. They never was there for me. Right. Why should a stranger? I've only been knowing for three, four years. Why can I count on this person more than I can count on? I think I think it was my whole life. I think it was birthed in from like from being with your grandma, where it's just like siblings, siblings, so, siblings, yeah. and I mean nobody really know the other half of it, but we was you know we had those dark times where it's foster, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Like so it was only when we go to these people's house, it's us, like you know what I mean? Like when we get over here and we jumping from here to here, and they like, hey, we about to split? We ain't split, no. No, it's us. It's us. So I just think like that was kind of burnt in my head mm -hmm. where it's just like always look out for your siblings. And that's been in my brain, not knowing that they coming up in a different type of world. They coming up in a survival in a type of, you know what I mean? Like, yeah, survival. They trying to make sure they eat. I'm right. the one that's going out trying to make the make sure everybody eat. eat. And yeah. I have to figure out like, bro, they're not going to look out for you as long as they full. You could be their bones. And they like, if we was, <laughs> if it was years ago, we was like with the dinosaurs. Yeah. You probably would have been on a chopping block. Like, you know what you I mean? You have to learn that. You I, gotta I learn have to that learn fact. the same thing. Right. And you know what? It's a beautiful thing once you actually. And I don't have kids. So I think that's a big part. After you actually understand it and you apply it to your life, it makes all that guilt and grief, it makes it go away. Right. Because now you feel you feel a, a weight lift off your shoulders. It's right. like, okay, I understand this shit now. Right. And it's going to take time. Everybody's right. journey is but, different. Yeah. Always say. Yeah. 
our book is written, we just turn yeah, in the page. Ladies, For sure. Facts. I always say that because life, it, it could be this way. Like you said, it was, man, right. we got to stick together when we was in that situation. But then you grow up and you become somebody, right. and then they're stuck where they're at, or they have that mindset, but you've elevated. And okay, your let, energy me, let me ask better. you a question. Let's ask you a question. Let's say, let's say you get a half a million dollar check. Let's say you, Mimi, the kids, and everything. Let's say, and let's say you start living. Living, you got the car you want. Let's say a couple years from now. You don't think shit like that will affect you? Where it's just like, you smart, so you know Hey, this is how we going to live monthly, whatever the case may be. And you just chilling. You don't think your past demon is going to start coming up on you? Like, you know what I mean? Because I feel like once you're out of your nest for a certain time, that's when it started trying to affect you. Like, when you grow up in that hood environment and all this other shit, like, wow, let's say, you know, you, you come from where you come from. And let's say it might take you about three years when you mow your lawn, and you be like, Something just don't feel right, you know what I mean? Because you've been out of that element for so long, and it's just like, okay, now this shit is coming back. Like, I feel like that's where the survival's remorse coming because that's called trauma. Yeah, that's where it's mm -hmm. coming. <laughs> that's what, and that's Jay, nigga, listen, you're nigga, you're traumatized, nigga. My thing is, I I, I, I do this. I, I'm I'm an influencer, but dude, I'm a shrink. Nigga, you fucked up. Listen, nigga, you fucked up. Nigga, you fucked up. I swear, that's, that's called true. trauma, and it's, it's for you to get over that. Oh, right, right, yeah. Because. No one is controlling your shit. Right. That's you. All of that is you. Right. So once you understand it for yourself, right. it feels so much more differently. You're too worried about what what these people, what they feel, how they're gonna look at this. No, I, I don't. I don't feel. look. I don't care about how they look at. It just affect. I'm not a person that's you gonna like, say you like shit. I got all the money. I ain't breaking bread. With e my even people. if even if. And, that, that goes for anybody. Like, let's say Von hit me up like, bro, something went down or whatever. And I tell him, bro, I ain't got it. And I know I got it. It'll, ask Batala, it'll eat me up. I'll be like, bro, oh, should that's, I send Von yeah. that, bro? Should I send Von? And he, Batala will be like, you told him, what you tell him? I'm like, nah, well, bro, I don't know. And let me just tell him I, I got it. Like, you know what I mean? Like, I'm kind of like that because, like, they hit me up. Be like, okay, this you going on, this going heart. on. Exactly. Yeah. And it got me fucked up a lot. Like I told I you, got I got a, I, I got apartments in my name now that I'm I don't live in. I didn't bought cars. You are I didn't bought Young, cars. Let me I tell you something. My brother caught a case, right? Yeah. For something he did. As Vicky. I spent ten thousand dollars on my brother. After he caught that case, he fucked up again. I spent ten thousand dollars on a lawyer for you to get your shit together. I went broke. Right. To make sure you stay out of trouble. You gonna fuck up again, right? So it's how long does it face. take for you to understand that right. you're gonna live for your? It don't matter if you got kids. Right. You got a girl. You right. got a wife. Right. Y'all making own family. Right. So if you spending your money on people that don't give a fuck about them, how you gonna pay your bills? Exactly. You have to realize when you I get what I'm that, saying. It took me a long time. Right. Mo, you got this. Even if I thought to say no, I right. feel I'll bad. make the same face right. every time. I'll be like, <laughs> I swear to God. I know I fucking got it, but I it takes time. I know you it's gonna take to I, I know it's gonna take like, I know it's you know gonna what? take no. I know it's gonna take time for me, but I feel like it's coming. It's, like mm -hmm. I, I, what I'm saying right now for y'all, I y'all gonna know exactly what I'm saying because the that, fact that you're talking that about it is enough. That but hundred dollars, that hundred dollars or that five hundred dollars gonna seem like shit Sick. to you, and you gonna find yourself doing it. But I'm been through it. You when Vicky like will tell you, I was making so much money doing her. Right. When I was doing, when I came out to join, Vicky put me on. I was making almost close to ten G's a month doing her. Right. So ask me where I'm at now. Okay. I okay. That you, and I that's, know that's you, taking and, care humbling. of my people. That's humbling. Okay, my but, mom be like, but tell me that, son. Tell, I need a hundred dollars. Where your hundred dollars going? But 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 like he just said, tell you where he at now. You see, like y'all telling me, it, ha it has to crash. But nobody's telling me that they didn't do it. That's yeah. all I'm saying. I did it. I know. But I, I, I learned. I know it's coming it. to a point where I'm I'm done with with the shit now. Mm -hmm. I tell all the time, man. Fuck, I, oh, I'm no, done with the shit. I, now. I'll, yeah, I'll yeah, tell you yeah, firsthand. Yeah. I, I was you. No, that's that's why yeah. I'm asking. That's I, where I, I really I, at, uh, at this yeah. very I'm moment. Now, we was you, there. We I'm was there at this very moment. Yeah. Oh yeah, I'm done. Mm -hmm. But I was just asking y'all like, how do y'all deal with that survivors remorse? Oh yeah, yeah. Like before, I used to be like, okay, Vicky be like, I be like, I had five G's in my pocket. 
Okay, my mom asked me for a hundred. Like for a hundred, ain't nothing. Exactly. You, you start know what I'm saying? Like that ain't nothing. Yeah. Like, you know what now, I mean? I'm like, damn, what the fuck? I go in my pocket, I don't got nothing. And then you go ask for a hundred dollars, and they feel like that's the most. Right. Oh, now, now I'll be like, can I get a hundred? No, they like. I did a prank. <laughs> I did a prank. Calling my people's, asking them for money for a goddamn something. It was something funny. <laughs> right. uh, 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 with, the, with the booty thing. Yeah, yeah. Clear my phone. I'm calling out. <laughs> I'm like, I need 200. Every person I call, I swear I had the same reaction. Bro. What? You need some money? Mm-hmm. Like, damn, I can't need money now. <laughs> right. Like, everybody think I'm just like this. Balling out of control. Mm-hmm. Right. I manage my money. I make it look good. Right. I'm not rich, G. Mm-hmm. What I want like, y'all to understand, <laughs> what we're telling y'all, we don't have a 401k. And man. We but are no. we are paid, what, what do they say? Workers or mm-hmm. whatever the word is. Exactly. So, Independent contractor. Mm-hmm. Exactly. So royalties comes from the video that you posted. They put ads on there. You get paid from the ads. That's royalties. You don't you might get, have a couple sponsorships. And you might, that's going to come af, okay. outside of YouTube. But it's nothing that's going to be consistent on contract. That's going to be like, Mo is getting this consistently for the next year, right. for the next two years. Mo can get one of the biggest checks she ever got next month and, and cannot get a check ever again. After. Right, after <laughs> five. So y'all have to understand some of these YouTubers, or a lot of these YouTubers getting that money and it's like, how much I have to spend in this month. I have to make sure this goes. Cause mm-hmm. like after a while, bro, who wants to be a has been? I'm right. scared when it comes to that. Like that's why mm-hmm. me and Batala say, if y'all don't, uh, y'all be like, y'all doing a lot. Y'all can say y'all doing it, but we save crazy because I never want to be a has I never want to be a has Even when some shit happened, I'm like, are we, are we doing too much, bro? Are we doing too much? Like, I never want to be a has been. So, like, I'm be trying to tell y'all, think about y'all favorite YouTubers popping now or all the YouTubers that we just saw past years that's not popping now. Mm-hmm. That's broke. Like, you know what I mean? Who ain't got it no more? That's that's uh, working a nine to five type shit. I know right. nobody want to do this. What's the point of grinding so hard for three years later to be fucked up? Like, you know what I mean? So... And that's yeah. why you can't be stuck in just a YouTube way. No, you exactly. can't. You, you know, got to invest in a lot of shit, exactly. though. And, that, and, and, you know, you you get noticed. People see you. Take opportunities. Exactly. Right. You exactly. know what I'm saying? Don't be scared to branch out and do other things. And that's where I'm at right now. Like, I got a lot of other shit going on, a lot of other opportunities. And I'm looking to just... Y'all are looking at three Milwaukee kids. And yeah, we at the bottom of the yeah, map. Y'all knew where Milwaukee <laughs> man. Three Milwaukee kids, you we taking risk. We at the bottom of the map, Houston, and we don't know nothing around. But we're, you know what I mean? Like I'm almost. I don't want to put address out there, but coming to this space doing a podcast, you taking, you know what I mean? You taking your own risk. You putting your money where your mouth is to do something to create something. You know what mm-hmm. I mean? To so yeah, it's just one. Well, of those. I believe like if you got a dream, you don't give up on that dream, right? And if people ain't there when it comes to seeing your dream, that you got to leave them behind. It's a reason why people don't be in your future, bro. Right. You Everybody can't force be in your future. your future. Question. You question. I got a question from mom. Then I got a question from mom. I'm I'm weird when it comes to like shit. If if it happens a long time, so I remember the first time I came over to the south side when I got my hair done by Vicky, mm-hmm. stuff like that. Me and Vaughn probably saw, you know what I mean? Like, you know, obviously she doing my hair and shit like that. Yeah. You don't really talk to uh, customers or whatever the case may be. I don't think me and Vaughn actually said something to each other until he did my hair. <laughs> and, yeah. you know, that was weird because like, I never yeah. had a guy do my hair yeah, type yeah. shit. The question I want to ask, like, do you think if you were never, like, curious to, like, what I was doing, what do you think you would have did YouTube? No, I think I would have fell back to the streets. No, no, shit, no, this is a serious you. question, like, because sometimes people are like, oh, yeah, That's I probably would have picked it up, my, my, no, with my the YouTube, sister would have did it or whatever. When I was in prison, I watched this little boy, he used to do skating. Right. And he was talking about sponsorship and all that, how he was getting money doing YouTube. Right. So I came out without already in my, ta- in, in my mentality. Right. But the streets got a hold of me, I'm like, right. man, I'm about to go ahead and do something else. Right. You brought that to my attention. 
I'm like, okay, maybe that's real. Remind him. Right. You know what I'm saying? Remind me, but that's the reason. A lot of us forget how to entertain angels. Right. God bring people in your life for a reason. Because a lot of us fall back to the old us. Right. God bring the angel back to remind you what was your mission. Right. And you was my mission. Because I don't think that me. you started right away. Uh-uh. But I think that you were like, I kept coming and you, you like kept acting yeah, as mind. we came, that's as I came crazy. back, kept coming good. back. Like, and that, that, that was a question I was going to ask you because I was going to ask you about your, how did you get into YouTube as far as like Milwaukee wise? Like, um, I got into it with my girl. I left the house. I moved out. I went to my cousin's house. She was watching a movie. I said, what the hell is you watching? Right. Somebody eat? You're weird as fuck. <laughs> I was talking shit. No, like, I watch this when I eat. Right. So I'm watching it. I found myself start watching. I'm like, oh, shit, right. they mm-hmm. fucking this food up. It look good. <laughs> so I'm watching it, and I stumble upon Jazz and Armand and Trey. Yeah. And Queen and Clarence. And mm. I stumble upon that whole group. I'm like, it blew my mind. Right. I'm like, mm-hmm. I can do this shit. Right. You know what I'm saying? What year was this? This was like 17. 17, okay. And that's when and I that's watched when her. was still in the trenches, too. Right. Yeah. So we they sta- worked. We they started. Where was at. We started literally the same, what, with uh, with Queen and them? I got I got Queen on my Facebook. I was Facebook friends with Queen before Queen ever took off. Mm-hmm. Like when they used to do that shit in that crib, in, mm-hmm. in that crib and shit, when they first had this, the small little baby, their first baby. It was CJ, whatever his name is. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And I was friends with them. They used to share shit and all type of shit. Like, it's crazy how they just blew up. But we started along with them and DMB Nation. Mm-hmm. And DMB Nation just took the fuck off. They were, they were dropping eight videos a night. So, these kind of compete with that. You know, the <laughs> dude who uh, do videos with his mama, it was him, his cousin, and his mama. His mama be cussing them out. And yeah, 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 yeah. DTTV or some shit. DVTV. Something like yeah, that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The girl, K, he's doing videos right now. Yeah. Say, he's saying his girlfriend... She used to promote me Over before real? she even got big. Like she, we used to chop it up in my. I still got our DMs. Right, well, actually, I don't because it took that. Instagram. <laughs> but to this day, like you know what I'm saying, right? And to see where she's at now, to know she was already five hundred k ahead of me, right. and to see my accomplishments, it's like okay, I'm grateful for that. Mm-hmm. So to you know, like you were saying, like. What made a, what gave us that drive? Yeah. It was it was a a pocket of different things, right? Because my cousin put me on to something, then I stumbled onto this, then I actually started doing, and this person gave me the ambition and gave me the uh, motivation to do more. Because I so feel like, so, like I feel like sometimes we we don't know that we it don't supposed to be, it's supposed to be for us when it don't take that much stuff for us to do it. Like you said, it was like wasn't like that for me. Oh, I looked at the shit and I started doing the shit. Like, you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. That's when you, well, what you mean? I looked at it and knew. Well, yeah, kind of. Yeah, like, like what I'm yeah, like, it'd take 30 it was, niggas to be like, get up and make a video. Yeah. You was mm-hmm. like, I uh-uh. want to do this shit. Uh-uh. Like, you know what I mean? I had maybe 500 videos and I wasn't even viral yet. Right. But I you were still working though. 2.1K videos. She quit though time. for a little bit. I quit for a whole year. She quit for a whole oh, year, yeah. I, I, man, I went through a breakup, me and mm-hmm. my girl. It was bad. It was terrible. Okay, so this better make my point right quick before you get into that. That year, did, when you quit, when you had, you know, let go of the YouTube shit, what year was that? Because um, I feel like this going to make a point. 2018. 20. Okay, so me and Vitala was doing on the same shit. We was, and we kind of took a break too because a lot of shit was going on. Mm-hmm. And that was around the same time, 2018, 2019. And it's funny because I feel like that's the time where everybody went to that next fucking level. It is. Everybody that was, was doing that shit to that. went to that next level. And I feel like we missed the mark because we stopped. Because every yeah. video that we was doing, like I did a video when Vitala pushed me over the thing, did, was doing numbers. Numbers. I, we weren't even getting, we weren't even getting uh, subscribers. Our shit was like one point some subscribers, but then you go to our videos, it was like 30K, 40K, 50K. I swear to God, bro. That's why we must be. I swear to God. Like, I was exactly at that. And I stopped because I was having, like, relationship issues. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And then one day, 
the Popeyes versus Chick Fil A shit just yeah. was booming. Um, I said, "Hop on this trend." I did it. Blew up viral overnight. Facebook, two point seven million. Three point next day, three point seven million. Wow! It, it just kept going up. I think that video now is at about twenty seven million. Wow! Mm-hmm. It's big. So after that, it was like. The subscribers came in because I, I I got smart. I put my link on it because yeah. I did a Facebook Live and a YouTube video. Right. The YouTube video ain't even at a million. Mm-hmm. Wow. And it's crazy because I told Batala that. like 800 and something K. Mm-hmm. I was working at, Pep, I was, was it Pepsi or Frito-Lay at the time? That's where I, the majority of my yeah, money was yeah, coming from. Yep. I was, man, when I say working my ass off, I mean, we, that's when we had a Mustang. And a condo downtown. Like, mm-hmm. if anybody knew, it looked like we was getting money because we both was working. And I was working, like, I had to be there what, at 3 a.m. And I ain't get off to like 5 p.m. Like, I was busting in hours, getting paid like $17 an hour back then. That's That was some money. That was good money. That was hey. some good ass money. I working at this third party. We used, to get, we used to get into it because I didn't see the blessing. Think about it right now. You see all this shit coming from, because where she at right now. Mm-hmm. And our, you know, our, our couple's trying to ain't really doing. Really nothing because we haven't been posting on there. Me and her got into a big ass uh, argument because I wanted her to quit ASMR. Damn. She was like at five, about to reach 10K. And I just felt like. Too much. Yeah. She wasn't That's like. That's why me and my girl got into it. She didn't, bro. She when felt I, like YouTube was all uh, my attention. attention she, yeah. No, it wasn't that with, with her. It was just like when it came to couple channel, she didn't want to do nothing, but she had locked herself in the bathroom to do ASMR. And I'm like, okay, okay, let's do this couple channel. But then what really used to piss me off is then she'd get on there and watch Armand and Trey and all that. And I'd be like, that's film. That's film. But she had watched them like, look what they just did. And I'd be in the car like, <laughs> we can be right there. Like, why is you idolizing them? Like, yeah. Why is you idolizing them and all this other shit? But she'd yeah. go and be like, guess what? I'm having success. So it was at a point where I had to trick my, I had to stop my own ego because mm-hmm. it was to the point where I, I thought she wanted to be successful on her own. Mm-hmm. Because yeah. I'm like, you're, it's not YouTube because you're going and making these videos by yourself. Right. But when I'm telling you to come with me, it's just like, no, nah, I don't want to do it. And I just felt like she was like, you know, I got my own success. I'm doing this shit. And I'm just like, okay. damn, you kind of much mm-hmm. li- like leaving me hanging. Yeah. And I always told myself, I'm going to start my own channel. 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 But I never started my own channel. I always be like, come on, let's work together. Let's work together. Let's work together. And when I start seeing that shit pop off, I'm like, maybe this is good. The top, what, like four of her videos? Her first four videos that blew to a million that got a profit from, I gave her all ideas for that shit once I stopped my own ego. Wow. Mm. I say what I once, say. Once I stopped my own ego, it I was like, you know what? Your book you, already read. You know you what? Read Let me help her with this because she's doing her own shit. She's still, she's still getting views. Mm-hmm. But I'm like, okay. I felt like it was like some like some pedophile shit. Like, I was like, okay, this was some weird motherfuckers watching motherfuckers do sounds. Right. So I'm like, okay, if they looking for you to do this, do this. So I ended up giving her like four or five ideas and those was made her blow the fuck up. So I feel like if I would have stayed on that ego trip, like, no, nah, quit. We wouldn't even be here today yeah. type right. shit. You know what I mean? Yeah. It's the point. for a reason though. Them four videos, I'm talking about back to back. Million, 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 million. It was to the point where it was just like, I didn't really fuck with the ASMR. She had come to me like, what you? I'm like, okay, to this point, you got to figure out your own shit because I don't even know. I was just throwing shit out there. And it was just like, shit started going up and she ended up reaching 100K in like no time. What, like three months? No, no, I was like, I'm talking about 100K. That that hundred K came quick. She basically. was going quick though. Every, yeah, that hundred K. I be quick. I ain't gonna lie. I be look. I be like. I don't know. You want to call me a stalker? <laughs> <laughs> but I be on that. I be just trying to see where she at. Right. I'm like, damn. She just got. And that's the same thing with Mo when she did Ask Vicky. A lot of people don't know. I be. I'm getting with Mo now, but I was. Right. Uh, Mo and Mimi. Now, yeah, and they would go by M M Squad. Right. So I'm on why 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 K. why did you change that? Did Mimi, of the situation did Mimi feel some type of Oh, okay. She did, but that's my baby. I put okay. her off. You know what I'm saying? Regardless. <laughs> for sure, for sure. Because she still do videos with me, but right. I'm getting lit with Mo now. Right. I'm branded. Right. So it's like, okay, I can't take that back. But, you know, I'm like, you know, my girl ain't real passionate right. about YouTube. It's right. not her niche. I mean, you know I mean, <laughs> same shit. <laughs> same shit with Matala. Like, you know, business got to be in order. Right. So 
basically basically but Tyler under me type shit. Mm-hmm. Oh girl, you're not finna just leave and like, right. <laughs> Oh shorty, no, like so I mean <laughs> But yeah, up until I went viral, I was mowing Mimi. Right. Yeah. And then I changed the channel name and made it my own because we broke up right. and everything that happened, I went my separate way. Right. But then three months later we got back together. So right. it was like you make a channel right so now you got your own shit we got a family channel and i got a move bank uh asmr channel right so now we four channels strong but only two of them really making any money, money right but that's fine right because you know it's it has all to about month. a journey exactly it's a journey it's a journey but that's like vicky's vicky never wanted to be on the camera never. Right. never now she be she Blossom. got her own I watched shit it. I, I her first own video but on but but vicky used to let you do your own shit Cause remember what uh, Oh Vicky gonna support Oh yeah she Bond Cause y'all used to do whatever. When you first started um, What house was y'all in Y'all was, we in was on, on 65th and Minchin No 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 Six- On 35th Oh, you That's talking when y'all about, did like that slime and all that stuff. Yeah, like, yeah, oh, yeah, yep. yeah. We started doing the slime yeah, on 35th and State. On 35th and State, that's when my daughter Aaliyah came around. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah, like they was. They she was never blocked. Up. That's why I be. That's why I say I love Vicky. Because I had two baby mamas. I, I had a contract with TMG Warner Brothers before I got locked up. Okay. I ain't signed the contract. It was a seven year contract. The most I would make fifty thousand dollars. Oh, on a seventy. Oh, shit. so I never signed the contract yeah, because I took to it to a lawyer. Jail. Right. <laughs> so I, I gave it to a lawyer, and they were right. like, "This is not a good contract." Right. But before that, I had baby mamas. I was like, "I don't want you rapping. All these girls gonna like Vicky. Not like that." She said, "Baby, that's your dream. Right. Follow your dream. Right. You know what I'm saying? You be rapping, bro." Yeah, bro. I'll be in the like, studio. I'll be in the studio. Bro. I gotta come to the studio. I'll be in yeah. the studio, bro. Oh, <laughs> yeah. I gotta, for real? When I start hearing, I hear your music, bro. Uh, I'm like, this man, right? I want to go, you bro. Rap? Yeah, yeah, bro. You yeah. never heard his song. Mm-hmm. Bro, this is what this shit is all about, yeah. bro. I'll be in the studio. Bro, I got the whole hook, like, bro, without. Wow. Come uh, come with me on, uh, what's the 25th? Too, so. What's the, 20, 20, the 21st or 22nd? With the whole thing I got set up? But yeah, like, bro, dude, I'm a alcoholic, and I'm, I'm not a hooker, I'm a workaholic. <laughs> you say I'm a, damn near, damn near. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a workaholic in the studio, bro. Bro, I'm telling you, like, I shit, love music, bro, bro. I got the whole thing set up, bro. I'm finna meet with somebody next week that that fuck with the whole future shit, all this extra shit. Like, oh, me yeah. and me been working since I came to Houston, and it's crazy because I I developed like this friendship with him. And he knew all the connects. Like, so I'll be on his, I'll be on his page. Like you said, you be stalking. I'll be on his page. He be with everybody. Like all the uh Chicago. He was just with uh Lil Mouse and all the top YouTubers, like yeah, yeah. Nymere and all of them. Yeah. Like everybody be I going to him and shit. Mm. I love his music. But I be on like the cool no. side with him type shit. Like mm-hmm. I've just been like kicking it and shit like that. Then he was like, oh Jay, come here and I'm let you meet such and such and the um what's his name? I guess he's supposed to have Carl come. You know who Carl is? Mm-hmm. 51. They had Megan. Yeah. The Me- yeah, he's supposed to come too. They they got beats and shit they wanted to show me. I was oh. telling him I got my own sh- label, all that shit. It has been like almost a year and I'm just like now trying to, because I'll I be trying to tell people like, when it comes to friendships, start fucking with people before you just right. ask him mm-hmm. motherfucking shit, yeah. bro. Like, That's why I don't do a lot of collabs. Right. Because mm-hmm. I feel like you should really get to know mm-hmm. him. Like, right. I don't want to sit down with you right. and do videos and I don't even know you. That, and that's that'd be, weird. And that'd be the thing about me. I'd be like, I hope motherfuckers don't think I don't fuck with people mm-hmm. because right. I just be so busy. And yeah. I said that to Vital. I'm like, I hope Vada and Mo don't think I don't fuck with them because yeah. I don't be coming we around to them. Right, that one, that one. like, damn, no, and, then, no, and then when I did it to him, I'm like, okay, oh, nah, no, no, he's feeling that. No, be, <laughs> yeah, well, I'll be so busy, and I, I'm like, I be need friends to understand certain shit. Yeah, like, yeah, it's yeah, not yeah. a no. I'm right. If you know me, you know I'm a rock with you 24 seven. Anytime right. you call, I got you. I'll pull up whatever the time, and I'm very friendly. Right. But most of the time, I just be so busy. Sometimes yeah, I just yeah. be like, I wish they could come it's here. I just be this and that. I just be like, damn, I hope they don't really. Think, like I'm a and fake ass understand. nigga, bro. We like, today. right? I'm, we understand because we know it's like yeah. you know what I'm saying. Right. Sometimes we be in the back of your head, you be like, damn, he just played us. But then it be like, he probably was busy, bro. You know what I'm and y'all so far, bro. I be like, yeah. damn, bro. Like. I was really at the crib. I was really at the crib. Like, I wish we would have met them before they moved, bro. 
Where y'all was at was not that long from us. It was probably like a 15 minute drive. 15, y'all. 15 minute drive. Right, right up there. I'm like, on fuck, bro. Yeah. And I, now y'all going so far, y'all be dropping videos, be dropping videos. Y'all be making me get on my shit. I'll be like, bro. Yeah, God damn, bro. It was- <laughs> Bro, we was going to bed, oh, we bro. Really I was gonna go crazy. I'm supposed to be recording right now. <laughs> we, but then Vaughn reminded me we had to come here. I'm like, yeah. okay, cool. Bro, I ain't gonna. Bro, we was going to bed, bro. I looked over, but Tyler always tell me to put my phone down because I got a habit. I won't go to sleep because I'll be on my. She like, put the phone down. As soon as I put the phone, I looked up. It said, Vaughn, come live or some shit. I'm like, this nigga doing a live? Like, oh my <laughs> God. Then I woke up. Then I woke up. Like, I think I woke up like probably like around like 10 or 11. He already dropped two videos in the morning. I'm like, this nigga is working hard, bro. And you watch the other podcast I was talking about with Vaughn. Like, the no. last three videos I've been talking about this nigga, bro. And I'm like, bro, like, he make me like, damn, I'm not doing shit. But I'll be like, okay, you got to do that show pace, bro. Because y'all be dropping videos. But I'll be like, it's three of them. Even though I'm seeing why I'm seeing because I follow you and I follow Ray and all y'all share each other shit mm-hmm. so I'll be thinking it's all coming from him but I had to look at the channel I'm like oh no that's coming from Mo yeah. and he in video with Ray then he in a video with this and he in video with your daughter and shit mm-hmm. I'm like fuck <laughs> like I need to start recording bro and hey, you know what's but, so crazy but it's me. good to have people like that yeah. that, that make you push Again. you know, push you bro shit, bro like, we been wanting this for the longest like, I've been I'm like I just need a group of people I can trust right. and work with and right. really love and be like family with. And we would have mm-hmm. came down Man. here and we would have came down here when y'all came there. We probably would have all been in the same house. Actually, we, thought we was looking for the same shit. We was like, bro, we need to find a YouTube, YouTube house. house. We were trying to yeah. do it with Shanice, but she had her you know, girlfriend and all that stuff mm-hmm. going, going at the time. And I'm like, damn, we want to do... You know, it'd be crazy if we could get a big ass mansion at the time, like like and just go is, crazy. Is she, like still linking with Binks? Oh uh, like yeah. They are, yeah. Is they back in uh uh she be going Detroit? back and she be going back. Yeah, Binks still in Detroit, but she be I going back and forth. Here for- no, nah, they be they they no, be. Been, they be she be they was here video for a minute. They was, about they, was right, they was right. That was right. Um, they was fifteen minutes. They was like yeah. ten minutes away from y'all. They was in mm-hmm. Pearl Land. Uh, yeah. it was an Airbnb out of Pearl Land. But she been um, talking about quitting, lady. Beans. I don't I, know. I don't you know how that shit. But they've been. Yeah. I've been watching that shit. They've been talking about quitting, lady. I just dropped a video about. Quitting. I'm just finna. And then who yeah. else dropped yeah, a, it? It's so on. many motherfuckers. <laughs> talk. But when it comes to that shit, I just look at it as like the people you keep in your circle is the people that motivate you. Yeah. Right. You feel what I'm saying? You Nowadays, it's a lot of people that be in friendship for the wrong reason. Right. You get right. what I'm saying? Using a motherfucker. But like I wake up, I see Mo do some shit. I see. I said, "Bro, I'll be so happy when I see her be successful." Did, did they see y'all any text messages about the? Man, I been passed up. My shit was six thirty. One thirty. Okay, we for the. Uh, wrap it up soon. We gonna wrap it up like ten minutes. Was still record- I forgot we was doing the damn podcast. <laughs> see, that's why we said podcast. Just Bye, how you, that's how you vibe, vibe it. Talk we talk to uh, yeah. Probably do like fifteen more minutes, then we gonna wrap it up. Uh, if we went longer, you could just send me the and I'll pay it if if. Oh, it's all good. All right. But yeah, I'm just saying, Man, like, I it's, no time or nothing. Like, <laughs> yeah, it's just the people you keep around you, bro. Right. It's like, Mo, like, a lot of people be like, oh, you using Mo or Mo paying for. Listen, it's networking. Right. That's YouTube. That's right. how you get bigger. And that's that's like you doing construction. You got to network with an electrician. Exactly. You got to network with the next person. Right. That's how you get farther in life. If I'm not networking, I'm going to be right here. And some niggas come to you looking for that. They're like, hey. Yeah. We coming to you, but do you know somebody who know how to do this? Right. Know you know, know right. Exactly. You know somebody that, 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 exactly. Because Vaughn is what, at 22K? 22K, yeah. I'm at 187,000 subscribers. Right. Mm-hmm. On the outside looking in, what the fuck can he do for me? Right. Right. You hear me? Right. right. It ain't about that. It's about the person he is mm-hmm. and the potential I see in him. For sure. Mm-hmm. So I'm not looking, I, I'm not out here looking for people bigger than me to join my team. Right. I want I want the un, I want the under uh dog. Right. Give yeah. them to me. People, because I know that they're gonna bring that heat. People mm-hmm. forget that every artist, like if you think about a like let's think about movies. Like when we go see movies, it's not the same actors. Right. New actors come up every fucking day. New mm-hmm. we wouldn't have 
we wouldn't have legends if we didn't have new artists. Like, if exactly. we just stuck on one motherfucker, the niggas would be dead Forever. by now. Mm-hmm. <laughs> like, bro, LeBron had to come after. Le- like, you know, we always have to take a chance on somebody, bro. Look, right. we looking at basketball players and root for other players. Twenty years ago, we wasn't root for them. Right. Twenty years ago, we probably wasn't born yet. But I'm just like, well, we was probably. Yeah, a couple of years old. Oh, right. Okay. Uh, 11, 10, 11. <laughs> nah. <laughs> but I'm just saying, back then you was rooting for some other players. Right. But now this time they're rooting for others, just like YouTube. A lot of people was looking at well, what's his what's the name I was telling you last week? Um Spoken Reasons. Y'all know who Spoken Reasons mm-hmm. is. He was big on YouTube like 2009, 2008, 2010 type of shit. Nobody know who the fuck he is now, 2022. Damn. And he and all this shit came from him. Like most of the time, the YouTube shit, CM, CM, well, CMNs or whatever that shit, all this shit came from him. Like most of the, what's that, uh, Emmanuel? Uh, you actually all them questions, like, all that right. shit. Like most of they scoped all this YouTube shit. Like you weren't really getting paid, like all that shit until motherfuckers came with that money, paid away, paid yeah. away, yeah. and all this other shit. But now. Some of them is dead in the in the right. in the headlights, bro. Be like that. Some, but listen, that's how you. That's why you got to keep the. But it's some friend. It yeah, but it's some God, right that's why now. You keep that's rich as fuck. Yeah. You know what I mean? So what do you Sit do? Back. So what do you do? You can be like, I don't want to be spoken reasons, but at that time, spoken reasons was on Star Wars. Mm-hmm. He had multiple shows. He was on TV shows. He was mm-hmm. doing all this other shit yeah. coming from Vine. You know what I mean? Had his own show, all types of shit. You didn't want to be him. He, yeah, he fucked up, but yeah, he had opportunity that he right. didn't, you know. He didn't go the right that's way. That's why you he don't burn right your way. bridges, bro. I don't think it was certain much no, it, 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 when you burn You don't never know. When you yeah. burn your bridges, you cut a lot of shit off. Yeah. When you 100 with people here and there, bro, you don't never cut nothing off. Yeah. Because if they know, if I, if I know, okay, if I'm grinding with Mo from when we was a kid, I'm gonna take care of her, but I think sometimes it be over investments. Mm-hmm. It's over, like, but a lot of people be investing be, money where they don't got money. But at. sometimes people believe in themselves too much. Too like, much. Like yeah. some of his story was basically like, what got me on was this shit. So I'm gonna take this money and put it back, and it's just like, yeah, you could take that. you could take seven hundred, you know, like let's say seventy five k, and make a video or make a a series, but you might not ever get back that Man, seventy. Yeah. You know what I mean? A lot of that shit was taking chances because that's what he was saying. Like I was taking a lot of chances. I moved to L A. where a lot of people fuck up at. Yeah. I moved to L A. all that high ass rent mm. and started trying to make these. These type of videos or these yeah. these indie movies and shit. Like, bro, we not up. known for you from indie movies. You trying to do that shit to go into another lane, but now mm-hmm. you fucking up all that money trying to hire a motherfucker, trying to get all these videos. Like, bro, you got rich off the phone. Right. Chill. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, the, phone. Yeah. Oh, man. the thing is, you don't really need... Your phone is... I swear to God, your phone is everything, bro. I made a lot of money off of iPhone. You can make a movie off of a iPhone, of bro. I, she made videos. Yeah. FBI, look at that. <laughs> you can make a movie she, off of iPhone, She bro. moving that, that, that pack. Hey, listen. Man. You made I a lot of money off that video, iPhone. But baby... <laughs> Recording a video. Listen. She said she made a lot of money off that who iPhone. Them, who the, what's his name? I um, never edited. Dude that video used to write for Lil Wayne. Other than my uh, uh, Gilly. Gilly, mm-hmm. his brother or his cousin, his whatever cousin, dude. Uh, Wallow. He said, "Man, if you got an iPhone, pick up your iPhone, record. Right. You get paid. You get." Bro, you won't even know if you go viral. Right. You can make a video, don't even know if it go viral. You put that shit. If y'all go on YouTube, go viral, if y'all go bro. to YouTube right now, y'all gonna see Skinny Me with my friends and shit starting this podcast back in 2017. I was the first motherfucker on podcast because I watched. Uh, was it Charlemagne when that was the podcast? Got, when yeah. it first came out, and you know what's crazy? My best friend Mac wanted to do one, and we recorded a couple, uh, like yeah. a couple yeah, episodes, yeah. but we never aired them. Wow. Cause he was, cause we just, we was in the process of moving. I was moving to Arizona. This is when I went to Arizona for a couple of years. Yeah. And then right when I went to Arizona, that's when I went viral. Wow. And I, I bought the setup and everything. I got the mics. I got I got all the shit set in my crib. <laughs> like literally, I bought everything. And my niggas was on some bullshit. Wow. They didn't. I'm like, bro. I was like I told you, I was that type where we came together and said, hey, we gonna bake a cake. Mm-hmm. I was the type of nigga that once y'all came to the crib, I had all the ingredients ready to bake that cake. And some niggas that was like, some niggas get mad where it's just like, 
You think we couldn't bring no ingredients? Nigga, right. fuck that. I got all of it. That's, that's do it. I'm here. super happy. Bro, right. all my niggas telling me, like, bro, we gonna do this, we gonna do this. Ask me, Tyler, I'm on Amazon buying everything, bro. Buy. Y'all say y'all gonna get y'all say y'all gonna give me the money back. That's all of it. I'm finna get everything. Mm-hmm. These mm-hmm. niggas mad cause they feel like I'm calling them broke. Like, bro. nigga, I just got everything. Let's do it. Bro, we could have went half with you, but we could have right. did this with you, like. It don't matter. I got everything, bro. Like, if you go, if that's their pride. That's though. the pride, that's bro. Like, pride. That's the, yeah. Like, if Undercover you want to hit me back, bro, let's hit me back, bro. Like that. Like, if I you want to go have, like, bro, right. I'm like, I be day, on bro. it. I just don't want to get to a point and be like, bro, you plus to took care of the lights, bro. Wait till I get paid. I'm gonna do the lights. You know what? I should just bought the fucking lights, bro. Like, mm-hmm. you know what I mean? And now we sitting here dark as fuck. Like, no, right. like trying to do this podcast, bro. Like, like, yeah, man. She used to be crazy. Mm. <laughs> Super hey, crazy. Would you meet people on the same with the same dreams and ambitions? For sure. I I definitely look at you as a person. I mean, you come from where I come from. For sure. You doing mm. your shit. You and your woman. Congratulations. Yeah. Fact. Y'all doing your shit. Look, man, look, for definitely. Real. And it, it it's just it's very inspiring. You right. say we inspire you, but you inspire us. Fact. You, you, you don't even know that. Like no. just. Knowing what y'all doing and what y'all got going on and watching y'all do what y'all do, right. man, that shit inspire us too. And it ain't even always about the numbers. It's right. about how you carry your yeah. shit yeah. Right. and how professional you are. Right. This shit right here blew my mind. Uh-huh. I ain't never did a video on a professional setup. And shit, uh-huh. you motive both of y'all motivate me. I was fifty, bro. Uh-huh. Every time I see y'all her number go up, I'll be like, oh my God. I see her number, I'll be like, oh my God, I gotta get my shit together. Right. This shit I made sure. I was like, man, we gotta make sure. Ask Mo. I said we gotta go to there. I made That's sure. Solid. I told Mo yeah, like we gotta you show up, bro. Do this type of shit, right? Right. And they and they sit there and act like, yeah, I already know this shit. Right. Yeah, Facts. we already doing this. Yeah. I ain't that nigga. Right. Facts. Bro, I've been through some shit, and right. I'm blessed and highly fucking right. Blessed. Mm-hmm. And I'm and I'm so grateful to even be sitting here doing this podcast with you right now because. Right. It could be anybody, right. but it's right. me and it's right. bro and it's right. you, right. and we from the same, same city, bro. Same city. And it's people there right now doing absolutely nothing, nothing. right on the block, killing dying, each other, killing, stealing. But you, chump you know change. what I'm saying? Chump I sat, I sat, and I looked out my window, and like you said, that uh, remorse shit. Yeah, not necessarily that, but I looked out the window and I said, damn. I ain't gonna lie, I was a little lit. <laughs> I looked out the window and cry, I said, Cry baby ass. Right. And, and, and you gotta, sometimes you gotta let them emotions out. But I looked out yeah. the window and I said, Wow. They said, Modi got drunk and started crying again. Yeah. Yeah. For real, though. I looked out the window and I said, Bro, I am really blessed. Exactly. Like, I was Thanks. just in a, a little ass apartment Man. a year ago, two bedroom, two bath. Shit, a roach crawled on the wall. <laughs> Man, I ain't scared shit. to say it. That right. Shit, that happened like, with us. Oh, look at what. And, and that's where I be like, trying to, You really have to And that's where I be saying Where the su- survivor's anyway. remorse Come in Cause like I said It's both of us So when we When I come downstairs You know You're in a big ass crazy Just be like Am I doing too much Like am I doing yeah. this Am I doing And like we it. all come Like we all come from Milwaukee shit. I don't care what part Milwaukee is Milwaukee, Milwaukee Like you know what I mean right. Like bro Like motherfuckers Did not have it all Like you know what I mean Like my grandma here She She wouldn't imagine Like you know what I mean Like she She couldn't imagine Nigga, we used to fight over the who fed to use the bus pass. My grandma used to get a free bus pass. We used to fight over when she come Swear home. Who fed to use the bus pass? Swear mm. to God. My grandma found out I bought a chain as much. She gone, nigga. Like who, <laughs> nigga? She her apartment. It used to be ten. Of, it used to be like what seven of us in a two bedroom apartment on Keith. You know where Keith at? <laughs> on Keith, <laughs> yes, what? off off Capitol. Like come on now, going to school, trying to not tell them. I was going to toast at the time. Thinking like, oh, if they find out I'm, I'm on key, they gonna kick me out because I'm not in the district no right. more. Mm-hmm. So it was just like trying to stay over there to get a good education type shit. But it's just like, and then my grandma, you know, had cancer at the time. So it's just like, bro, what the fuck? And I want to tell her, but tell her nothing. We was dating, but I want to tell her nothing. The shit I was going right. on. My cousin broke in, stole all my shit, and only had trucks. To my name. And it's just like, bro, mom didn't want. Nope. No, you can't. You can't. You can't come back here. You can't do all this sort of shit. Motherfuckers left me. Literally, as for it was to the point where I had to go live with my cousin that I ain't seen since I was a baby on my daddy's side, and mm. she let me in. It was either I was gonna have to call Batala mama and be like, I'm homeless, because right. my mom like, nah, 
Now look at you. Now, and that's what I'm saying where I be feeling like the, the black sheep sometimes because I just be like, niggas want to expect look at this that one. It's a bad thing, though. It's not. Yeah. Being a black sheep of the family is actually yeah, a good, good thing right, because you know right. why? You did something all 10 of them didn't do. Different. You did something right. all 10 of them was scared to do. Right. You did something all 10 of them didn't have the didn't, balls didn't right. want to do. do. And that's why I always break a vine because, like I said, like my brothers and sisters was close. When we had a condo, they'd come over there, see, they see, they see Vaughn ain't never been to my crib. Like he never seen nothing. So I would think a person that will see some shit, you know how like, well, wake you know up. how cash oh, money do to like yeah. recruit niggas, come to the crib, you recruit yeah. niggas, everybody see the cars and shit. Uh-huh. I'm a sign on down the line. Everybody see everything, but it still didn't drive them to do nothing. nothing. It was just like seeing bro and getting my hair braided and he like, bro, I'm doing this or the time he wanted to quit or when he was putting your, when he was putting your cousin on, when you and your right. cousin do that shit. Yeah. It's just like, then when I start seeing them like, go, I'm like, damn bro, it's really at this shit, like really on the shit. Doing and what you, I wish my people yeah. did. Hey, wish that then he hit me up like, bro, I think we're gonna be in uh Houston. I'm like, bro, you better move out here, bro. Yeah. Shit, like it was crazy to me, bro. Like, damn, mm-hmm. like somebody we don't have the blood. We don't have the same blood, but that's what I noticed. Like, bro, you don't have to have the same blood, bro. Like, oh, yeah, bro, huh. yo, I'm thinking my blood gonna do the same shit. I'm thinking like these niggas gonna be the same niggas that's gonna mm-hmm. do this shit. Same niggas gonna go gonna, gonna drive and do this shit. Like right. It, Nope. That wasn't the case. That's why I say when you become a, when you become a grown up for real, you realize, man, you you build your own family for sure. Right. Your right. family, they're your blood. They're right. biological, but they don't yeah. always treat you like family or act like family. That's why when you saw when I came over your house when I first got my hair braided when they first got it, that's yeah. why I was so happy. I'm like, bro, these niggas actually doing it, bro. Yeah. I was so happy for y'all when I when I first when we could, uh I braided my hair when I first came up by your house. Yeah. I was just like, bro, like, wow. Like, yeah. were y'all actually about to move down here? Y'all actually about to, like, bro, that's crazy, bro. Because, yeah. like, I've never seen nobody who's, like, not saying he took my words because he did his own shit. Like, I say that all the time. It wasn't no hand like this. It wasn't no, Jay, tell me how to do this. Tell me. It was just like, oh, okay. Then you would just see, bro, doing his own shit. And that'd be the good shit because niggas don't need, them the best niggas when niggas don't need a, a, a helping hand. Right. You can just mm-hmm. tell them niggas to do shit and they just, they do their own shit. Even if they don't listen to you, they still in the same facility of doing it, of doing their own shit. And it's just like, damn, like, I didn't put the nigga on, but it's just like, it's good that, like, bro, still follow that shit because I know what it can do. I know what it, how it changed our life. And it's just like, you sit there and tell people, like, bro, just just do it. I'm telling you, it's going to change your life type mm-hmm. shit. And I'll be telling that when he said he wanted to quit, like, a couple years ago, but now it's to the point where you ain't got to tell him that no more. Like, mm-hmm. <laughs> you good, bro. Right. And it's like, right. you never told me that you went to jail for seven years. Bro. That's mind boggling right now to be like, mm-hmm. bro, even went to jail for seven. Niggas can't tell me shit. <laughs> like, you can't tell me shit, bro. Like, bro, you can't right. tell me shit, bro. I'm already knowing where y'all He's going. He's a living testimony right. of success, of, yeah. of, 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 of overcoming all the bullshit. And I'm not even trying to, like, be on y'all oh, dick or anything yeah. like that, but me and Shanice... Uh, we literally had the same conversation. Where Shanice was at when we had a conversation in Milwaukee? <laughs> like she was probably at like 40, 50 k. Oh, yeah. She, she, I was high. I was. I'm telling everything I'm telling y'all. I'm like, we was. Batala was higher there at the time. She had like three million up. I'm on the phone Damn. with her. Like, bro, she like, ooh, I can't wait to get a buzz down. And she's like, she gloating about the shit that we doing, all the shoes and shit. I'm like, bro. Yo, t- the way that you doing it, bro, you gonna have it. Then, Chase, stop telling me that. You geeking my head up. I'm like, bro, the videos that you posting, you just gotta keep going. This 2018 going on 2019. I'm like, bro, keep going it, bro. You gonna be big. You gonna be this. You're like, man, I just want this watch. I just want this. I can't wait for this. I can't wait for that. Now we're shit right now. And we done had the same conversation. It's crazy. Three million, seven million. Like, Damn. if you watch the, the, the little podcast that we had, like, bro, it's crazy. Because, like, I'm not just telling y'all that to be friends. Like, right. bro, when I see shit in motherfuckers, bro, look where she at now. And it's just like, and nothing changed between me and Shanice. It's not like, oh, fuck her. She got bigger than us. Like, we're right. still just like this. Like, you know what I mean? Yeah. Like, we still kicking. She still come over by the crib. That's, like, the only person that come over by the crib. And it's just like, she from Milwaukee, too. Like, you know what I mean? It's just mm-hmm. like. It was at a time where we all chopped it up just like this on the phone in Milwaukee, and she was 
under us and I was telling her the same shit like bro you keep doing that shit you're gonna be popping and she was just thinking like I'm just geeking her motherfucking head I'm like right. bro man whatever bro you geeking my head I'm like nah bro I'm, I can see it bro like you're dropping videos daily all type of shit she'll tell you she was in a, a one, she was not even a one bedroom a studio in, Meta, in Minnesota in college damn Man, dropping those videos, not dropping those up. videos. Not to cut, I got a pig. <laughs> yeah. I ain't gonna lie, I got you. All right, we gotta try, we gotta edit it anyway. <laughs> I got this a pig, my nigga. This man, I mean, I own that shit, this man like. respectfully, <laughs> this man respectfully arrogant. Um, shout out to Mo, shout out to Vi. Thank you. They man. said they will be consistently on the podcast. I'm so most just definitely, will, I will. This will be co hosts instead of guests. So um, we'll see if they. Stay true to that. We we'll will see. We ain't will. Got no faith in us, right. <laughs> no. I just got to be or not. I don't still talk. No, no. <laughs> it's just so. It's just so far from each other. That's what I'm saying. Right, like, yeah. most this like, minutes, man, like, ain't nothing. Most definitely <laughs> be here every <laughs> Tuesday. Every Tuesday we're gonna be knocking it out, man. Um, shit, it'll be even better because then you know. Well, you start getting more up, guys yeah. and it's just not me. So when motherfuckers come on here, like I'm trying to get Corey, but it's keep going back and forth and all this yeah. extra shit. You know, Corey Carmen. Yeah, you yeah, I'm trying to get brought in. Huh? Yeah. Dose and Nisha? Who the you hell is that? Them. You don't know Dose yeah. and Nisha? We be nah. chopping it up with them. We'll, we'll yeah. talk. Yeah, we'll yeah, talk. We'll Honestly, talk. Sean Kogas, we go try to figure it out. Yeah. I've just been respectfully arrogant with Von Mo, your boy, Jacoby. So funny. Y'all already know what it is. What's y'all Instagrams? Uh, Von Crazy Family. Follow me at Get Lit with Mo, all underscores in between, man. All right. Y'all already know what it is. And we back into the next one. We outie. Peace. 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 <laughs>